Let me have the first sip. I won't put it on my lips. Get it Let him waterfall it, dude. Waterfall it. Come on, bro. No, come on. Please. Oh, there's a bunch. In I would do that for you. Then I'll lock your. I would do that for you. Pour it out in the sink. You'll be pissed for 15 minutes, then you'll feel amazing. And you'll thank yourself. <laughs> I know I want it. Why would I be pissed? Because you're craving it, but that's. Pour the... it out in the sink. If you really Why would want... I pour it out in the sink? If you I really want, want to drink it. If you really want the energy, you take trust me a hundred of those <laughs> ice cold Red Bulls and you get it in a bath. And then you that get in the bath. Awesome. Or just one yerba mate, dude. Oh, Trust no. me. That's a panic attack waiting to happen. I'm off two right now. Jesus, Jesus Christ. Christ. This was at oh, shit. Milligrams of caffeine. I'm a fucking monster. Boys, sizzling like bacon. That hand You've gone was through trembling. the wall. So much caffeine, you're tired again? I'm exhausted. <laughs> that actually happens easily. Yeah. Uh, by the way, we're sponsored by Roback. Roback.com. Promo code YAK. 20% off your first purchase. Wearing the joggers right now is wearing the shorts all weekend. Roback.com, Q-Zips, polos, hoodies, shorts, joggers, everything, t-shirts, Roback.com. The best. What's up, guys? Best of all time. Good to see you guys. Are we doing this show wrong? Should we just be having fucking Steven playing every one of our parts, editing it, and then we can just dub ourselves over? Just when we want to, royal family style? <laughs> yeah. That we should do an smart. episode. That's S crazy. Steven plays every seat. Yeah. <laughs> then we come in and say our lines. Right. I downloaded professor. chat GPT this weekend. Maybe we have chat GPT write us one and we just come and uh, do our lines whenever we, we feel convenient or yeah. just Can send them in. How much was she getting paid? 20 million. Not bad. Bad. Just her? Who? Uh, and Prince Harry, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. They got their podcast deal was ended. And there's like a bunch of news coming out. And one of the stories today was that Meghan Markle would have a staffer do the interviews, and then she would come in and, and tape the questions. No way, really? Yeah. It was a 20 million for like six episodes? Well, so hard. That's smart. 12? 12 episodes. Crazy. 20 million. Really smart. <laughs> what do they talk about on their podcast? I think like issues. Changing the world. Yeah. How to colonize countries better. Yeah. What's the sweetest way to colonize? Oh, whatever they did to Honduras, dude. Why they did a bad job down it, there? Yeah, awful, awful. Oh. We 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 fucked up Honduras. No, Prince what have you been ha reading? There is no saving Honduras. Prince Harry's white guilt must be suffocating. Oh yeah, definitely. Well, not enough to work. I'd get a fucking restaurant job if I was him. He should have. He when he when he denounced the royal family, he should have had to get like an internship at Barstool Sports. Bust his ass. I don't want his blue penis on um, sitting next to me. <laughs> Get get rid of the coffee tables. Casey Casey knocks against his shin and dies. Eyes. <laughs> that bastard. Did he not admit he had a blue penis in his book? Oh, he must have read it. Okay. Yeah. Did he? Did he? Is that what's in there? I feel like every penis has a little bit of a blue tint to it. Not no. Disagree. Like a little like a little purple purplish tint. Purple is fine. Purple maybe. What do you mean? Like a hue? Yeah. Like a undertone. The cock ring. Purple. I don't have any blue in my penis. Mine's a, it's warm colors. Makes you feel anger. <laughs> Makes you, you want to leave. You paint a jail cell, my dick. Guy. It's like the inside of a McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> you think there's gay you dudes going. like dying their penis the rainbow flag this month? Oh, their pubes. Definitely their pubes. Maybe their ball hair, if that's a thing that people have. <laughs> their thick ball hair. <laughs> you can't even see the skin. <laughs> it's probably hard to dye a penis think so i think it's got to be because they're just like well how you, you can't dye skin you, you just know? get like the markers uh, yeah it would have to be markers or stickers or something like that yeah i bet there's a handful of dudes out there with a rainbow cock right now yeah, yeah you could probably do that like hydro dipping right yeah that would be cool yeah that would be sweet oh that would be sweet the one where it's like a layer on the top yeah or the Those old classic videos are great lipstick you know five different guys lipstick yeah and then just Go down further and further. Or girls, depending on what kind of gay you are. True. I don't judge. Lesbians. I don't judge if you want to be a lesbian or if you want to be a gay. Shit, Stay I Stay away from our kids. <laughs> yeah. Stay oh, the I'm going to Stay away from the school, all right? <laughs> and off the internet. I love the dudes that don't have kids. <laughs> <laughs> Those guys are just as creepy. Oh, they're so passionate. I'm here to protect children. the kids. Like, yeah. oh, yeah? Your kid in middle school? No. I don't have any children. <laughs> 
uncle energy guys who aren't even really uncles. Yeah, right. Just spend their whole day thinking about how the kids. A guardian have uncle. To be safe. <laughs> yeah, that's so weird. That's a little too much to me. That's worse than a. That's pedophile? all they think about. It's, it's pedophile adjacent. It's You're thinking a lot adjacent. about kids that aren't yours. Pedophiles probably get it off their mind. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. they can, like move on to the next thing. Not these guys. Fucking perverts. They like fantasize about having their like their son, their fictional son's right. third grade classroom be a trans girl so they could like or trans Step boy up. so they yeah. could like come in and like th- strangle her parents. <laughs> yes. It's also like like I get it. It's a very touchy topic right now, but the idea of like a guy with no children in like New Jersey getting upset about a middle school in like Oregon. Like fucking leave the kids leave our kids alone. It's like, Dude, they, they're like I'm driving out to Oregon. <laughs> Like, yeah. Shut this shit down. Don't you have other things they're in like your life? They're like 44, and they're like, when I have kids, I can't. What, what am I going to do? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Someday I'm going to have kids. I want to make it a future them. father right now. <laughs> yeah. yeah. They're celebrating breed of Father's future Day. Father. Proud future fathers. Proud future they're overly father proud awesome future t-shirt. fathers. <laughs> yeah. They're like, aren't you going to wish me happy Father's Day? <laughs> what is this? It is easier for a father to have children than for children to have a real father. <laughs> From a pope who has never had kids. <laughs> Fuck do you know, dude? <sighs> pope John the 23rd made that meme. Yeah, you think some of those dudes were celebrating Father's Day? And like someday. <laughs> Poor kid. Oh, Rome, was that me and you cracking up at Lenny Kravitz's dick and balls coming out? Did we yes. touch on that oh topic? Yeah, the- dude, that was awesome. What happened to Lenny Kravitz's dick and balls? His you reveal. Know. You know. What happened? You've seen the video. Ever. I have not seen the video. It was of course, th- you, you have. His pants explode and his so, penis Yeah. Well, no. Well, when your just out? your penis comes out, it's kind of still masculine. Yeah. And you're still in control. When your dick and balls plop out, that's, that's when facts. It, it's all shame. Lenny Kravitz's dick and, and balls. balls. Yeah, he squatted. At a concert, as he was in leather pants doing a guitar solo, Dropping down low to make it real funky. How was that not? How was and everything cool? flopped? Everything flopped out. It, it, the the balls come out too. As the soon ball- as the balls are exposed as well, it, that's it, right. it loses. It's an explosion. If your dick's like over your waistband. That's like whatever. But as soon as the balls, like when you get, think about like getting pants when you're in like middle school. The, the, I guess is it the movement? Is, it, yeah, is that what makes it embarrassing? Jiggle. The jiggle, the hang. I think it's balls are the, the presence, the, body, the visual yeah. presence of the balls. Balls yeah. are the gayest part of the body? By a mile. More yeah. gay than the asshole. They're also, just think about it, they're, they're also like, they look weird, they're ugly, and the only thing that can happen with them is get hurt. Yeah. Yeah, there's no feeling, there's no like good feeling around the balls. Oh, well, getting them sucked on? No way. No. That actually hurts. <laughs> you, ever see, you ever see that in like a porn <laughs> when a chick like sucks a ball? Yeah. You're like, what the fuck? Yeah. Hard, yeah. Oh, they suck them hard. Yeah, real hard. Or, of course, the old classic dick in the ass, balls in the pussy. Yeah. Just a oh. You guys never saw the that balls video? Balls aren't big enough. No. Was on the pussy? A guy dip- or the dick yeah. in the ass and balls in the pussy? <laughs> I don't got that type of length. <laughs> oh, no. a, a You need some guys. stretchy balls to pull off that move. I got, I got dick in the ass, balls in the lower ass. <laughs> 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 oh my fucking god! In the ass balls in the pussy. What is, is that a thing? It was a video that we would like watch all the time in college. The guy was just like narrating it into the camera. <laughs> oh, how do you even do that? It was kind of like how, have you ever seen tea steeped? <laughs> oh, you steep? Yeah, yeah. You know, you're like, like kind of steep, slightly tea. putting yeah. it in. No, oh, I understand how the balls could get into the pussy. <laughs> I don't understand how you could how, how your balls are that long. I know. I don't. It's kind of like when you reach into a jar of pickles, kind of like yeah. <laughs> like this type of. Damn. Anyway, just on the door. Then I'm, I'm like tip of the penis and the belly button <laughs> balls in the pussy. Yeah, that's we, how I roll. We gotta get Nick the uh, Lenny Kravitz video. I like to see. I want to see it. I gotta. I gotta get my. Have you never saw it? No. Right You've I never saw the Lenny Kravitz's balls popping. Oh. Nick, I sent no. you. No. Oh, you sent it. Yeah. Oh, I thought this was like I thought this like just happened. No, no, this is like an old timeless. Her celebrating Lenny Kravitz. I think Tom Segura yeah, tweeted out the video of the guy with his balls in his own ass. Have you ever seen that video? That's I a good one. I have. <laughs> Isn't that a pleasant little surprise? Yeah. Wait, it keeps going to me. I want to see it too. It keeps going. Throw it in the yak chat. I want Colby to be able to see it too. This wasn't like the guy dancing at the wedding when his dick and balls pop out. Have you guys seen that one? Ooh, I, oh, 
It does sound familiar, but it, they all kind of run together. The dick and balls popping out. Dancing at wedding. Penis and balls pop all the way out. Okay. Oh, yeah, this is old. This is a classic. Maybe have seen this. Yeah, this guy. Look, how, look how hard he's rocking. Woo! <laughs> oh, yeah. You knew. Too. He knew the second it happened. Yeah, but he keeps going. And he finds a way to tuck his balls behind his he's legs. He's doing a little Buffalo Bill action. Buffalo Bill's his balls. I just sent my favorite. Oh! Whoa! Whoa! Rowan, I just sent my favorite dick and ball pop out video. It's the guy dancing at the wedding. If anybody wants to Can watch we show it, these, TJ, um, or no? Pants during no. dance reveals dangling dong. Penis. He's got a massive... Oh! <laughs> his dick is fucking huge. <sighs> In what, vi the viral hog video or Kravitz? Oh, and the, 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 da the musician one. Lenny Kravitz, yeah, that would make sense. Dude, how does the guy at the oh! wedding... At the wedding? <laughs> what is that? It's what, your your underwear and the pants break at the you same time? You must have time? gone underwearless, because I don't... That's crazy. That's insane to get that low and go underwearless in what I presume to be a uh, tailored suit. Yeah. I don't I've... think that that's a shameful thing at all oh, yeah, I think that's actually impressive yeah there's probably yeah. dudes making tear away pants yeah. <laughs> he's got a big ball sack i've had i've i've split some pants at a wedding before that's really sucks. yeah i've never split pants oh no, i never have splitting them at your penis is a whole different bag in my ass in front i've Look at the video that nick just put in there kb there's a there's a fresh video of uh of a guy dancing at a wedding and his penis flops out I don't even know how we got on Kravitz. Maybe the fact that Lisa Bonet was fucking Kravitz and then m now Momoa. Kravitz to Momoa, and then now they're divorced. Who's next? Kravitz fucks so well. Yeah. Yeah, whichever. Everything, Ambiguously too. raised the guy. Everything. Next. <laughs> I got a. F yeah. Guys, girls, everything. <laughs> yeah. Hero. He pleases every. Fuck, he's an old school rock and roll fucker. Right. You just get get loose in the multiple suite organs. at a rich Carlton. Apparently, he would clog every hotel toilet with just his shit. I, Who's that? That can happen. Kravitz. I've had that happen to me. Not me, but it's happened to me. I got yes. a toilet clogger waiting to come out right now. Yeah? All right, son. Come on now. <laughs> <laughs> Let that thing go, then. No, I'm holding on to it. A little pep in my step. <laughs> hey, if it if it lands on wet four straight, you gotta it's, shit yourself. All of your shits are debilitating. Oh, they are. Really it's bad. It's That's bad. how I know you didn't quit drinking. No, I I broke last night. Oh, oh no! <laughs> yeah, I actually, I feel really bad about myself right now. I went eleven days. It's a lot. Yeah, it's huge. And then I broke. Yeah, but it's just it did. It's it streaking MLB. That that is bottom line. I, I should have talking about it. I should have gone the full eight eight two days. weeks. It's three more days. Yeah, but well, you, you were trying to go a month. <laughs> well, originally it was two weeks, and then I was like, ah. Uh, Who okay. originally says two weeks? That's our. That's a lie. Why? You either a week or a month. You actually set it at two weeks. Yeah. I yeah two weeks is a, a two weeks is a is a long time. It's just a, a weird crazy. span of time to choose. Yeah. Really? Yeah. yeah. I mean, I'm not. I wasn't ever like planning on fully quitting drinking. I just wanted to. I thought it was a month. It was two weeks, and then I said a month. And also, you can't do that in the summer. I can, and it was actually well, no, going you, really well. And you I'm literally can't feeling you really prove that you can. not What made you break? Uh, I went to Shane's show last night, and then we went out. Damn. Oh, no. You, uh, you survived Ontario. Easily. Oh, yeah, how was the That's flight the, back? That was probably the biggest challenge. Uh, yeah, it was like, but it, it, it was and it wasn't. There was one show where I really wanted to drink because I, I felt very tight on stage, but then I just fucking powered through. What was the locale of, like, Ontario like? Dude, Ontario was one of the weirder... Did you hit the Rainforest Cafe? No, I didn't hit anything. Uh, we we went shopping. We did, we did a little shopping day. Who were you with? Uh, Mook nice. and uh, this kid, Andrew, who was open for me before. What, uh, and, uh, where, where'd, you, where, where'd you guys shop? I feel like it's a strip mall-ass area. The whole city is one strip mall. <laughs> it's like you're, you're just bouncing around from strip mall to strip mall. So where'd you city. shop? Men's Warehouse? We hit Uniqlo, and then we hit Tommy Bahamas. Hell yes. You Tommy know, Bahamas didn't pick, up has any, some... didn't pick up any Tommy Bahamas, but I did buy some Tommy Bahama-esque shirts from Uniqlo that were $50 cheaper. Oh, but not nice. Yeah. Oh, they're nice. Tommy Bahama, nice, yeah. though. They have piece, they have, the, some of the t-shirts are fantastic pieces. There, there'll be wordplay, and there'll be like a dog on a surfboard or yeah, some shit. Yeah, there were some dog surfboard 
They got those long sleeve shirts that you wear when you fish. Yes. Yeah. Keys. Yeah, but you got to be in pretty good shape to rock one of those. No, you got to be old as hell and like you just are like, okay, I'll just wear this for the rest of my life. Yeah, I did pick up some. I'm gonna wear. I'm gonna. I'm gonna be wearing some button ups this summer though. Like what? My new look, I think. Just like like uh, patterned tees. Pattern. Hawaiian. Yeah, Hawaiian. She just said Hawaiian. Yeah, I don't know. Hawaiians aren't button ups. Oh, they are. They button up. Tactically, but they're Hawaiians. They're yeah. its own class. Yeah. Uniqlo makes some good Hawaiians. I was gonna. Start. I had no idea. Yeah. Uniqlo's the best. Where's it from? Pan, but made in China. Really? Yes. <laughs> yeah. It's a Japanese brand, right? Yeah. Yeah, but it's everything's made in China. I didn't know that. Yeah. yeah they like their shirts. The- they're so thick you can't see any this shape of your body. Same with uh, Abercrombie. Mm-hmm. They're just making clothes so cheap that like you can just afford to just throw them in the trash after wearing them once. It's fucking awesome. But they're good quality clothes. So you know someone's little infant hands are working (laughs) over time. Uniqlo, like this shirt is like thick as hell. And it's like a good quality shirt. You're still wearing shirt underneath. And this is $15. This shirt anywhere else would be $70. So you know there's children working on this shirt. Yeah. 100%. And they're doing a great job. They need some positive affirmation. They do. So I I always pictured in my head it, how does it actually work with the kids making these sh- making these clothes? Their little hands. Are they in like a where where are they? A warehouse probably. Is there any footage? Sweatshop footage. Are they all like in a in a group in a class. I do love that. I I think I maybe it's just my algorithm has got this for me. But there's like I've seen a ton of tweets about like little little kids in like West Virginia in like the turn of the century. Working in mines. Oh, and they stuff, were like, being like they were nine back when like America was America. It's like yeah, and we had our seven year olds working. Yeah, those are the people that they go on TikTok and they're like, I'm, I was born in the wrong generation. It's like, dude, you would be in a fucking coal mine. They'd be using you to detect yeah. carbon monoxide. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's just like this love affair with like a hundred years ago. Yeah, it's crazy. That, that child fucking, died. Yeah. You had five minutes to get out of there. Yeah, yeah. That fucking big ass dude who's yeah. always posting those videos, he would be in a he would be in a mine right yeah. now. Or if he'd be like lucky, the first soldier to die. Yeah. yeah. If you're lucky enough to survive childbirth, yeah. you get to go to a mine <laughs> when you're five. Yeah. Yeah. You will be dead by eighteen. Then get drafted to the military to carry a flag. Yeah. God forbid God forbid you break your ankle when you're four. You're yeah. dead. Yeah, they'll just leave you. Like, oh man, that, those are the days. When people were for social media. <laughs> when people were old age at yeah. forty two. Guy, people would die at 45 with a heart attack be like, well, he had a good run. You could die of I natural wouldn't... causes at 11. Yeah. <laughs> it was no just time. questions asked. It was just time. Like when loyalty meant something. <laughs> <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> Dude, at the end of uh, Phil Knight's book, Shoe Dog, uh, he was like, and we have come under a lot of scrutiny for Nike's use of sweatshops, but I personally went to the sweatshops in Asia and can testify that we had the least bad sweatshops of all the sweatshops. Oh, nice. oh, oh okay. Nice. I will continue to support. That's One what I'm the... saying. I need to see what the sweatshops look like inside. I bet you it's not that bad. I bet it's you probably, probably pretty bad. bad. Probably you think like, everyone has their own area, like, like something a like this? Sensory area. <laughs> yeah, it's like <laughs> they, they, they like, got a kinetic table. sand and like, they got it's a like the headspace chair. headquarters. <laughs> uh-huh, like a putting green. <laughs> One of the funniest, always sunny bits is is Frank saying that he went to Vietnam. <laughs> and he had a sweatshop in Vietnam. He kept he keeps on being like, yeah, back when I was in Nam. And they're like, you owned a sweatshop in Vietnam. <laughs> <laughs> in, yeah, in, the yeah, yeah. in the 90s. Yeah. <laughs> there was no regulation. Yeah, yeah. They were just polluting to pollute. Viet yeah, dudes awesome. are getting a lot of hate. <laughs> the parking lot of the sweatshops, just all those like little tyke cars. <laughs> <laughs> little car tyke pulling rickshaws. On <laughs> <laughs> car pulling on pegs. Yeah. <laughs> Try- Dude's pulling up in the Lightning McQueen electric car. <laughs> in the yeah. VIP. Yeah. yeah. CEO. Little sweatshop CEO. Yeah, man. Yeah, I bet you it's all right there. I bet you they're fine. Probably chill. You think they get paid? They Not d- a lot. But they get paid, but it's like, you know. It's more affordable. Money's than there. Yeah, money yeah. is worthless there. It's not like New York City. Ungrateful bastards. 
I'm gonna have the same energy for those kids who are making like a thousand dollars a year that people have for me for making not a lot of money at 22. Maybe if they get a little a life experience. Bastard. You're yeah. 12. Yeah. What do you yeah. expect? Yeah. You can buy all the ice cream. The table. Yeah. I can't imagine being mad about getting paid at 22. In Guangzhou province. <laughs> in my head down in a fucking sewer when I was 22. Oh, Diego, he's doing this on purpose. Of course he is. He needs a little attention. It loses a little bit of the luster. It does, yeah. I understand, though. He's doing... He's he's trying to make a name for himself. Anyone who walks through here more than twice during the yak is doing it on purpose. Yeah, or they just don't think about us and Mm. it's tinted. Yeah, yeah, that is also true. They're just going to where they go. (laughs) No way, because when Francis dropped something there last week, he's the most sure-handed man I've ever met. Yeah. He doesn't drop things. He doesn't drop things. There There are a group of people not... On this floor, but upstairs, who who like will schedule me for meetings at like one thirty? We've been doing the show for a really long time. How long have you guys been doing it? Six years? Seven? Six? Dave today was like, "How about we do the rundown at twelve forty-five? I was like, "I kind of have this thing at one." Yeah, trying it out. <laughs> <It's> a little, <laughs> we're trying to go mega. <laughs> we're emerging. Like, can we do twelve <laughs> thirty? Emerging. Yeah, we're so close to mega. Oh, we got. Uh, I don't think so. I think we're like fifth on emerging. Oh, we were third on emerging. We were third on emerging? Okay. Was that in order? I don't know. Who made that? Probably Greer. I want to know exactly who came, what we have to do. The guy who got hired to just fire everyone. Oh, we got a consultant in? We got like an Accenture guy? That's got to be a pretty I've already, I've already connected with him trying to get on his good side. Yeah. Let me know if you need any help. Any oh, names you need. You bet. If your Imagine. TikTok doesn't grow. <laughs> Imagine if they just fired you. I mean, <laughs> that would be crazy. They sat me and Kyle down. They were like, your guys' podcast, we already have one of these, and showed us your logo. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are, well, this is redundant. They showed us the same thing with macro dosing. I was like, what the, f- <laughs> the fuck is this? Fired. Yeah, macro dos- dosing really took off. I remember when, when we when our podcast and macro dosing came out at the same time, they were like, these are the next two brands. And now macro dosing gets like a million views every episode, and we're just Merging. right at the same. What is below emerging? Challenged. 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 Damn. I can tell you what we need to hit. We got a lot. Oh, yeah. yeah, Give us some figures. Uh, The main one is 150K views per episode. Okay. We're like around like, is that with podcast? Yes. So what are we at? Like daily has to help. I can't tell you that number. We're like around 120. We're above 75, under 150. But there were weekly podcasts that had 150. Why can't we just combine our five episodes? Yeah. Because that's the metrics they're measuring. Are we hurting ourselves by doing every day? So to go mega, it's all about views or it's what views merch and money. Yeah. And so how, everyone, please we like make the up stream. for the views with lots of money. I think you need to be above all of the metrics to be mega. What if I put a cash infusion into Yak? Buy buy ten thousand t-shirts right now. You would hit mega. <laughs> we, Who's in mega? What do we get for being mega? Do we get like a ceremony? It might be worth it. Yeah, I have no idea. What if you buy all the t-shirts and then we resell all the t-shirts? I'm just for the brand. Yeah, I would. I'm the dad it. who buys all the Girl Scout cookies. Yeah, we go yeah. My to daughter was number one seller. <laughs> my yeah, my yak boys were mega. <laughs> it's like oh, I did it. I can't afford my house because I'm just it's full of yak t-shirts. It'd be worth it though. It would be worth it. Flex on everyone that we're mega. The Yak just surpassed five and a half years this weekend. Wow. Holy fuck. What a mile. We can legally drink. <laughs> Dog years. Yeah. Baby, you still going strong, no booze? Yeah, 51 days. Damn. We need a reverse intervention. I, d- I know, I do, yeah. I don't About think time. I do, dude. It feels so much better not drinking. My whole thing is like I'm not afraid of discomfort anymore, but I am afraid. I'm afraid of being hung over. Yeah. That's Steven, are there any water comfort. bottles in there? I need some water. The the mocktail the things that they're doing with mocktails these sure. days almost makes it worth not drinking. Uh, it doesn't make you feel drunk, which rocks. Uh, yeah, that's yeah. almost okay. The only the only difference is that you don't have, but they taste. Invariably better than alcoholic drinks, like a fucking good ass mocktail. Yeah, fucking knock your sock, but it does make you feel drunk. I've probably accidentally done fifty-one days. Really? Yeah, easily. Oh yeah, you don't really. In the drink. past, I yeah, I've I've done it accidentally for sure. Wow. Not even days. like one beer. I had one on Saturday night. I can't tell you the last time I had. I, I'm just obsessed. I don't with have time. I love the feeling of being drunk. 
<laughs> I do too. Yeah. I like the I like the feeling of getting drunk. I like the I wish feeling like of Quaaludes being. were back or like, like whatever. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. You, around day ten, I started being like, well, what it, what else is there? What what are the other options to have fun? And then I realized it's just pills, which are. I'm I'm starting to enjoy. Well, I meant substances lot. wise. I'm, oh, trying, I'm starting to. It's like started this week, like day 45 is when I started enjoying like riding a bike or. Yeah, I was having. I was like, dude, it was awesome not being hungover for that long. Well, that's the only reason. Like, I like getting drunk, but it's just not worth the time. See, my problem is I, I like, and I, I said this before, but it happened like last night. Like, I can't have one beer. And then not go out. That same, because I hate the taste of all alcohol. I like beer, but it's just once I have one, and then it's just, well, what are we doing now? What's next? Yeah. What's the move, boys? Yeah. So Roan devoted like a smooth hour the other day to flicking these boys up. High school. Ew, you money. Yeah. High school grads. Like they were about to graduate high school. We were um, in Long Island City, and these dudes were in front of the famous Pepsi sign in Long Island City. You can see it as you drive up. Oh, yeah. The, you know, what, what the hell highway is that? FDR? FDR. You drive up FDR, on the right, there's this sign. These dudes were flicking up in front of it. And I almost always, when I see people struggling to take a picture, try to help them. I try to take their picture yes. for them. I did that the next day, and it did felt you? so good. You they feel were so appreciative. Yes, I did it multiple, and sometimes you get turned down. Sometimes they're like, "I'm good." I was like, "Okay, perfect." I thought I'd ask, but then uh, the next day I did it again. I did it on Sunday. Just helping people. Take yeah, pictures. I went one for two on Saturday. A British family denied me. Did they? Which is weird of them. Just you, accept the help. Do you guys ever have people ask for directions and you don't know? That's the worst. That's embarrassing. Oh, I never know. I, ne- I never yeah. know in my own neighborhood. People ask me, like, I'll be I'll be standing on my street, and I'll be like, wait, what street is this again? And I won't, like, I just feel like such a schmuck. Knowing is so nice, though. I know. You feel like a genius. Uh-huh. You feel like Robinson Crusoe or like Magellan. You're I like, I can just, tell any direction. I usually just send people off. Like, yeah, go that way. And then I know that, uh-huh. like, once... They'll have to ask someone else, but I've yeah. done my job. I fucked up once. Uh, I was getting off at the same stop as this guy. He was like, hey, where's this stop? And I said, just get off when I do. And uh, I missed the stop. <laughs> <laughs> I was doing the crossword. I missed the fucking stop. So I had to get off, and I was in Brooklyn at this time. And we were trying to go down to uh, Wall Street. So you had to go back? With the guy. He went back with you? Yeah, he was pissed. Oh, my Man. God. That's a bad one. Did you explain that you had missed it? Yeah. That's brutal. Oh Should've my! Should have just gotten off and just. This guy him. was already like looking disheveled, like running late. It seemed. Oh no! <laughs> Why did he put his life in your hands? Yeah. You probably look like a city slicker. Yeah. Which is you nice. Look like a real New York boy. Yeah, they do. People do always ask the, us men for for directions. Well, crossword. If you're doing a crossword on the subway, people are like, "Oh, well, he born and no raised. tourist does a no. crossword on the subway." Mm-hmm. You're comfortable. Born and raised. You're you're, you're comfortable. You're a hundred percent. Won't miss your stop. Little did he know I had auto check on a Monday. So, big Damn. mistake. I always use auto check. Did you gotta stop? You no, got no. To you stop. gotta dip your toe. You start with the minis, then do Monday's auto check. Monday's without. Tuesday's auto check. Tuesday's without. It's a. It's you can't just dive in. What's auto check? What the hell's this? Is this Ron? Oh, it's Ron. I mean. Did you make the move? I made a move like yeah, five times. Do everything. That's amazing. That's so funny. Who took this video? Me. <laughs> uh, volume down. I think I said something whack. Like it wasn't offensive, but it was. But you just saw it happen to see <laughs> Roan, or were was, you with? What Roan? did you say? I think it was just unfunny. Were you with <laughs> Roan? <laughs> I think I. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That would be way. What, were, were, you, what were you guys doing yeah. together? <laughs> Playing bocce. Oh, hell yes. I think I said something bad this morning for a video, and I'm worried about it. For a video? For a video? Yeah. I hope they don't use it. I watched a video uh, of that I took last night, and I, and I heard my voice in the background, and I said some really unfunny things as yeah. well. It's the worst. Yeah. And hammered, just yelling. <sighs> that shit is embarrassing. Was it th- I'm the Joker? <laughs> Pretty close. <laughs> Where were you? How was the show Imagine last Imagine if I just did that yeah. every time I went out. Every time you got drunk. 
<laughs> long before you did it for this. Yeah. Uh, That's just something I've been doing for years. <laughs> it was just you know, a the face paint on. You're like, you're like, wait, <laughs> how many beers have we had? Or like, oh shit, I'm the Joker, baby. <laughs> I forgot. Stop drinking. That's like what people that watch the case race think. Yeah. Think that that's just how I am every night. Well, yeah, why wouldn't they? Yeah, I guess they're right. <laughs> <laughs> I hate myself so much right now. Stop. You do Popeye's No Bev pretty easily? I Popeye's No Bev so easily that it started making me question like what, why everyone was freaking out about it. Popeyes, Popeyes Every, no bev. Everybody was freaking out. Popeyes about biscuit that? no bev. So people always talk about how Popeyes <laughs> biscuit no you bev did pop, is you so did the, hard. You did the Popeyes biscuit? no bev. No, no bev. bev. So easy. You raw uh, dog it. It's a raw dog biscuit. biscuit. It's a moist buttered biscuit. Yesterday. Oh, you about how off? How how quickly after are you having bev? I I could have gone the I could have gone hours with no bev. That's crazy. It was not even like a I, I didn't even want bev. You just got biscuit in your throat. Dude, it was, it was, it, it's not hard to eat that biscuit. I, I, I assumed it was going to be so dry. Could you have licked a stamp afterward? Easily. <laughs> Easily. Could you have whistled? Easily. I think I, I think I did whistle. No Bev. What a, yeah. what a bold So move. easy. <laughs> yeah. I texted the fellas. I said, Popeye's no Bev. <laughs> yeah. What else did you get uh, when you, when you went to Popeye's? Uh, I got the, the spicy chicken strips and they were not good. We are like, it, it, you know when chicken, you can tell it's not cooked all the way through? Yeah. Yeah, that's how I got. I got, like, two bites in. I was like, this is, I think this might be it's raw al chicken. Dente. Yeah. Yeah. Al Why dente. Why is it chicken. snapping in my mouth? Yeah, that's the worst feeling. That that's this cold had to be Craven center. Popeyes. Yeah. There's Popeyes right across the street. They got that nice-ass fish sandwich. Yeah, I don't love Popeyes. I used to. I used to swear by Popeyes, and then I got really into Chick-fil-A, and now I'm Chick-fil-A sandwich is way better than the Popeyes sandwich. Yeah, but a fast food spot having mashed potatoes is nice. Yeah, that's true. What other ones do? The biscuit was damn good. AFC. Boston, Boston Market. You ever had Jollibee? Yes. Fried chicken and spaghetti? Yeah. What? It's a Filipino fried chicken spot. They also have spaghetti. Oh, really? They have a cute little mascot, don't they? It's like a bee. Yeah. Yeah, I've had that well, before. Well, that's cute. Or pinch his cheeks. Yeah. Did you say earlier people are getting on the Viet, the Viet Bros? You're right. right. They're like the, uh, the douchebags of uh, Asian? East Asians. Yeah. Really? What? Yeah, I didn't say it. Who's saying it? Who is saying it? Andrew Every, Schultz. <laughs> all the other Asians are saying it. Really? Yeah. What the fuck? Yeah, I guess they're fuck boys. Wait, you see that TikTok man on the street? Because they also said they were the most attractive. I'm, I'm tired of admitting that. But yes. Yeah. yeah. Hey, are you guys doing a video today? Yeah. Yes, we're golf. We're, we're we are. We're golfing. Golfing. Because he announced it. Yeah, oh, you guys are doing that. Marty somehow Guess knows what? Michael I'm Quinn. I'm gonna be on Barstool Sports tomorrow. It'll be my debut. We start shooting in the evening or at night. Yeah, we're golfing with him. Uh, I don't know how this came to be because I don't know if he's ever expressed interest in golfing. But we're golfing with him tonight. Um, but he was drunk at Jeremy's Ale House last night, saying that he hopes Barstool pays him for this. So. I took out a I took out a Benji. <laughs> That's good. That's yeah. not bad. How much did you pay Chet? Uh twenty twenty two hundred dollars. So you gotta pay him more than Chet. He has like five times the following of Chet. Thanks, Ron. The Chet's like A list. What do you think he is? He's S list. Barstool pays me for the appearance. Like, I'm, I'm like a world celebrity. Like, I think there should be money in it for me. I've been taken advantage by so many people, whether it's a show or it's a record deal. Huh. I did that record deal with the Gucci store song. I never saw a penny of it. That's low. Damn. He is a record. You lower than low? I think so. So yeah, just give him a hundred. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. My blue note's fucking filthy though. I dropped it when I leaving the ATM, so that's embarrassing. What ATM? Chase? Chase. Yeah, they got the dirtiest indoor floors. Homeless guys come in there just to pee. It was the Chinatown one, and then there's a chair in there that the security guard sits in. It's like a, a fold out lawn chair, but there's a hole in the middle. I think he poops. <laughs> That's such a power move. He just rips his pants through his dick and ball yeah. area and poops. <laughs> That's how it should be. What's this? He's live already. Oh. 
All oh. of his comments all day have been talking about Barstool, so people oh are very God. much anticipating this. Oh, no. Don't blow you, it. I'm surprised he hasn't done, like, BFFs. Yeah, I just don't know how it's come to golfing. Well, it's probably because I'm assuming Marty reached out. Yeah, but, like, to do anything, I think it was the, on their end to golf. I don't know. Really? Yeah. Or are they going to have him on Pick Central? Yeah. <laughs> I like the Blue Jays. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, uh, if he's already is he already drinking? Oh no, uh, not yet. But I assume that's what he's going okay. to go do right now. Oh, yeah, okay. I, he well, might not show might be tonight. A disaster. Oh, he'll show. What else is he going to do? He's, he's not that kind of flake. Yeah, he'll be there with bells on. You guys are going to pay him. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Paid appearance. I hope Barstool pays. Me. <laughs> you're good. There was a lot of comments asking if he's going on PMT. Oh, well, I guess you have to do that now. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> Someone asked, so now you have Shit. to do that. You just had Sean Evans. I would love World of T-shirts on Hot One. Oh man, that would be incredible. I was Sean Evans. Best. He is. He's the best dude. When was he in here? Because I would have freaked uh, out. It was like two weeks ago. God damn. Yeah, he's the man. Yeah, he cracks. He cracks me up. Uh, he's a great good interviewer, great dude. Yeah. Great dude. Uh, high noon. You want to do high noon ad? Yeah, I do. Four ads today. Talk about mega. That's mega. If you're a tequila lover who is never satisfied with malt hard seltzer offerings, you're going to love new high noon tequila seltzer. It's a premium hard seltzer, and I had two of them this weekend, and man, did it knock my socks off. After a long, beautiful Saturday of popping around New York to Bryant Park, and what's that island in the middle? Sullivan Island? In the middle of what? The island that's between... Roosevelt? Roosevelt Island. Yeah. I went to Roosevelt Island on oh, Saturday. Did. Yeah, just to see Summer what it was like. There. I was just curious about it. And uh, afterwards, I took a ferry back. I was like a little bit... Uh, between my, uh, my day and my dinner, I was like, high noon. Two high noon tequila seltzers. I was feeling absolutely fantastic, and they tasted so good. Only 100 calories, gluten-free, no added sugar. High Noon Tequila Seltzer is now available nationwide in four bright, crisp flavors, strawberry, lime, grapefruit, and passion fruit. Great outdoors, great on the island, great on the ferry, great on the bike. Great wherever you want to take them because they're portable. They come in a can. Look for them on Drizzly or at your local convenience or liquor store or visit highnoonspirits.com. To find some delicious, tasty, high noon premium tequila seltzers near you. The thinner can fits perfectly in like the loop of a carpenter jean. Yes. Holy shit, it does. You can also just load up on them. I bet I could fit eight in my pockets. Nah. You don't think? I think probably six. Six, six. Uh, no, eight. Eight. I could carry eight, but I could fit six in my pockets. Yeah. I didn't TikTok all weekend. I'm way behind. Start the algorithm's going to be very upset with you for that. Oh. Algorithm doesn't like when you get when you're neglectful. Fuck. Fucking uh, the. What are you? What are you just quit. <laughs> yeah. I could. You're right. <laughs> Fuck. You're right. Quit. I could quit. Quit. Yeah. How, just tell them to stop putting your takes on uh, or your uh, your clips on part of my take and just be like, hey, just put them on mine instead. Yeah. Hey, Don't all, quit. all the stuff you're doing for the brand, just do them for me personally instead. Yeah, you're right, KB. Mm -hmm. Just stop. Yeah. So pe people are starting to move out to Chicago already? Yeah, PFT and Hank are there. They're there already? Spider. Who's next? Malisek left, but he's not going to Chicago for like a month and a half. Yeah, well, I was, I was, I was, yeah, that's what I was trying to figure Virginia out. Virginia Hoos were terrible in the College World Series. When are they good? They suck. Virginia? Yeah. The only thing they, they're they good at is that naked run they do. And the Nazis. And loving Nazis. Probably some bad history down there. When were they, when did Recent they open history. up? Yeah, the when did they open up, right? Business. Wasn't that on their, was that near their school? What was Tiki Torches? Yeah, it was Charlottesville. Charlottesville. Steven, how was your Father's Day? You get everything you wanted? Uh, I think so, yeah. It was good. Played some ball. Hit some golf balls. It's a good day. Is that what ball you mean? Yeah, what ball did you play? Hoops. Ah. Played pickup for the first time in several years. And? Feet are covered in blisters right now. 
but uh, played well. What shoes did you wear? I, so I packed most of my uh, hooping shoes. So I played in Jordan 1s ter- oh. with one pair of socks. Terrible mistake. Ooh. You need to have like 12 pairs of socks. Yeah. Who'd you hoop with? Myself. And there were some people at the park that I met. Did you like, you were like, hey, you want to play? They asked me. They had, they had five. So we ran threes. Hell what do yeah. you do as a, a bespectacled man? You wear chums? Contacts. Oh, okay. You had some. Your cupcake video was confusing. Why? Damn, Jay. Was I feel like that it was I pretty self explanatory. Mm, I feel like a lot of people could do it, but I did it pretty cleanly. What did he do? Cupcake all in his mouth? He ate a cupcake. He's like, watch this. Cupcake. Dominated it. Everyone can do that. I don't think everyone can. I think Eat a cupcake? Eat a cupcake. In, w- in one bite? Yes. I think you could do that. I think Brandon can do that. I think that might be name, it. Bro. Put respect on my name. You can do, can it, do it. What? Absolutely. My jaw unhinges like a python. Okay. One of the all-time big mouths. Look at this. He's like, watch this. Oh, so not a big cupcake. No, it's oh, all, no, it's a, it's a regular cupcake. cupcake. No, wait, he that looks wait, wait, wait. Pause it. It's that big by Melissa shit. No. It looks like a thimble. Everyone, check this out. You're holding You're it just between gonna eat two fingers. Look at that. It's from a. Look at his face. Hey, who who wouldn't be able to fit that? Any human being. You did bad. <laughs> you did poorly. <laughs> who would Most not? No way. way. Is the highlight? It would be more shocking if one of us couldn't do that. That's yeah. Shock. Okay, bring in a box of these exact ones. They're from like a bakery in New Jersey. But... All right, so get them for roof ball day. Okay. When is roof ball? Thursday. Thursday. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. We need you there, buddy. I'll be there. I'm trying I'm to excited. I'm, I'm have anything on Thursday. Roof ball is going to be fun. Yeah. Do we know how the do we know how to play the game? Yeah, I'll be the ref. So who's competing? Uh all of you guys, Che, Clemmer, Jersey Jerry, and the homeowner. Great. You know and it's gonna I be think, it. I was talking to Michelangelo. I think the founder is going to fly out to sanction the event. What? Yes. So he'll be there on Thursday. That's incredible. I love that. Fully sh- sanctioned roof ball? Yes. Do we Let's th- not let him step on any toes. But this yeah, is we gotta we gotta do something to show him we're boss. I saw an early cut of the video that Doug's and Michelangelo did. And that's a no nonsense man that will be coming yeah, out. Yeah, I saw it as well. He we should pants him. There's no joking about it. We should pants him right away. We should give him a, a commemorative pair of pants that just rip away at his penis. Yeah. <laughs> as soon as he bends down Try to play these a little on. bit. They explode at the penis. How long does a game take, TJ? Um, it's ten throws per person, three people per game. What? Wait, we can't all play together? Three no. of it's th- three heats it's, of three, it's, it's and then, pod play, I think. Yeah, it's three heats of three, and then the winner Let's from each round pods. moves onto the finals. But is there also a winner from each round and then a fourth wild card? No, it's three play in the finals. Oh, really? We ha- how, how do, do we, we select the heats? Wait, so that. I don't really like that. I think that it should be the three best. That's what, we're, yeah, the the best person from each round. But that want. that doesn't necessarily mean we could the do best. a fourth wild card. It doesn't matter. Yeah, we do a fourth wild because like, okay. what happens if one pod is the is the pod of death? That's bullshit. How do you pick yeah. the wild card? Highest Bull score points. that didn't make it through. Yeah, yeah, highest score that didn't make it through. Let's pick the pods. I want to. I want to know. Right yeah, so we got to do it based on honor system. So just one to ten. How good are you? I'm a nine. <laughs> Uh, probably a. I'm a four. I give myself an, a humble eight. Eight, nine, eight. I, I'd say I'm an eight and a half. Eight and a half. I'm good at catching, but I don't know if I'm good at the moving throughout the lawn. Uh, I'll go seven and a half. Okay, so me right. and Roan will be in a. Yeah, I'm a four. Yeah, I'm a nine. Steven's probably pretty high. Steven, what, what are you? Oh, Roan, you're not a four. I can throw and catch, so. I don't know. Yeah, probably. Eight so wait, what range? is it? It's the five of us. <laughs> Steven, Jerry, Clemmer. That's only and the homeowner. Eight. Oh, and nine. Okay. Is the homeowner good? Yeah, what is his stats? Well, it's homeowner. Well, one it's child. Like, yeah. his metrics. One wife. Child. One wife. He, he can probably pra- see only one. He can Tradition. practice. Wife. What can do you practice. think about drag shows? <laughs> drag children's reading shows. <laughs> we need to know that before we go over there. Roof ball, but in drag. Holy shit! As God intended. Roof ball, all the guys, well, all of us are in thongs, and there's a field of children there watching us. If you were going to be in drag, what would your name be? <sighs> That's a good question, Che. Thanks. I think I'd probably just have to go Daniela, right? Mm. I don't think you have to be necessarily trans. Oh. Uh, 
What? Okay, what did you just do to us? What? Are, wait, drag isn't that? Yeah, you. you yeah, you, you can just make dress up, make up, up like a woman, and you can be yeah. you can be whoever you'd name. like. Yeah. Yeah, so it'd be Daniela. No. That's your I choice. Would probably go with a more masculine name. Really throw people off. Maybe I'd always. It'd be cool to be a uh, Christina with an X. Xtina. <laughs> That's a good drag name. Yeah, Xtina. Like Big Monica. Oh, Big Monica. <laughs> big Monica would be good. Yeah, exactly. Not Fat Monica. <laughs> big Monica. Yeah. Coming to the stage, Big Monica. Big Monica. It's a standing yeah. up. I like that. <laughs> You're Big Monica. Yeah, I am. Uh, big Monica's damn good for a drag name. Yeah. Do you want to be Little Monica? No, I'm Bowser. Oh, uh, you're yeah. Bowser. <laughs> I don't know what I would be. Stacy. Something, yeah. I'm trying to think of something with a snake in the name, like Python or Asper. I don't know. I don't know what it is. Samantha. Yeah, that's what it was. It'd be Viper <laughs> with like like Viper. Yeah. Yeah, Viper. Viper. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't do it. Thank you for taking that over. Okay, you got to do this wild honey, man. Yeah. Oh yeah, Donnie's here. You want to just do it now? I think Nick, you'd be. No, Nicholas. I want to do it in the morning, but I will. Uh, yeah, I, will I think do it I'd this be week. Nicholas Pussy. Yeah, or Lickalus. Oh, sure. Lickalus is good. Lickalus, like Legolas, but it is like, like Legolas, but also Nicholas. I never realized how close your name is to Legolas as it is. Nicholas Legolas. Yeah. Fuck. Whoa. What the hell was he trying to pull? Make it up a name like Legolas. Tolkien. Yeah. Well, how much? How much you hate dudes that do the uh, that like that business insider guy that do Nick with a ch? I could. That's how I spell my name, and I just I don't quite get it. I don't either. Let's do n i c k. Yeah. Because then it's the same as like r i c h, and you say that rich. Yeah, so niche. 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 Yeah. Niche. There's names like that where you're like you can't if you're a Nick you can't, can't accept him. Yeah. Can't have. I don't that. even like n i c. The Jeffs and Geoffs. Can't have that. Yeah, geoffs are crazy. Geoffs are wild. Yeah, I see. Like, geoff doesn't make sense at all to me. Jeffrey with the G off. Joffrey. You just should have to say it, Joffrey. Which is so embarrassing. Even if you're a royal. Are there any famous Jeffs with a G? Yes. Jeff Jenkins. Toys, Toys R Us. Jeffrey, the, yeah, Jeffrey, Jeffrey the, 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 the Butler <laughs> from <laughs> World Famous. Uh, he is. Jeffrey no. the Butler from. Um, What's Elmo's birthday again? February 3rd. <laughs> Same as mine. Who, who Jeffrey did? the Butler from Fresh Elmo. Prince. He, these are all Jeff fictional Schwartz. characters. Yes, I said Je- said, Jeff Jenkins, the baseball said player. Jay, he just, we asked if there's a famous Jeff, and he said, yeah. The yes. He's all right. How did you not think of it? A-lister. Who's that? That's a that's a dude Celebrity I recognize. from Chopped and others. Oh. Uh-oh. Jeffrey Zarkarian? Zarkarian? Cool last name. Geoff. Hmm. I don't think of other names that. If you're this. Names that can't be respected. Yeah. By their own community. It's like Travis and. I mean, Tavis. Like a Tavis and the Travis. Travis. There's too many Sean's. Too many variations of Sean. I don't fuck with any W. Yeah, what's the the Alpha oh, Sean like is W-N. EA, right? No, I, think I, so. think, I think A W N. You? No, 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 no. E S E A N is the Alpha Sean. Everything else is variant of that Sean. S H A W N, S H A U N, S H U A N. Those are all variants. C H O N E. Like Sean Green. Sean Fingens. Sean Sean Green was S H O N N, the running back. But S H Sean Green, the baseball player, was S H A W N. Yeah. Alexander was a UN. Damn. That's what I can contribute. But I think EA is the. Oh, yeah. S E A N? Yeah, that's the way they say That's yes. confused. That's pe- that confuses people. Oh, that's it's how it's seen. It, no. But that's how it was intended. It's like the Irish. It's God intended. Sean. Oh, it's Sean. Sean Green. Irish ass name. I don't buy it. How was the show last night, though, Sass? Oh, it was great. Shane's ready. Tell us everything about it, bro. Tell us about. Tell us some behind the scenes shit that we wouldn't have known. Yeah, he's doing um, a special, right? Coming up. Yeah, Saturday. <sighs> That's in front of the scenes, though. Give us behind the scenes. 
Uh, Bobby Lee and Andrew Santino were there. They opened. No. That was cool. They just they popped in. What'd they say? They did material. Nice. Santino was really fucking funny. Very funny. They comedian. killed. Big Cat with red hair? Yeah, I like him a lot. He was really good. What about uh, afterwards? What was that party like? It wasn't much of a party. Where was it? It was just a handful of fellas. Where was it? Uh, we just went to a bar. What bar? I don't remember what it was called. It was nice, though. It was a cool bar. Was there famous like people there? Wasted. No, there was no one there. Was there famous people that you guys were with? Uh, no. Just Shane and friends. Okay. Cardini. Buddy Marcello was there. It was cool. Marcello from SNL? Mm-hmm. Nice buddy to have. Marcelo Hernandez. 22 years old, just having buddies like that on SNL. Well, I've known him since before SNL. That rules that Shane's friends with a bunch of SNL guys. Yeah, I don't think he really is, though. Oh, well, you just I guess Michael one. Che. Um, well, Marcelo. Oh, that's your friend. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. My no, boy. they're friends. But it's more Sass's friend. I don't know. Yeah, let's say uh, hurt each other. What kind? Like kick each other's shins? I don't know. Like no. push each other's shoulders and kick each other's shins? No, do a shin kicking? No, yeah. that would I'd be down hurt. for a little bit of pain in shins. I mean, we need it. Mook tried to kick me in the shin uh, on Saturday night. Trying to, I'll get kicked in the shin. He's trying to compensate. Mook's he's, trying to compensate. He's, he's doing, like a kickboxing. He's doing now. kickboxing classes yeah. for like six months and doesn't have any kickboxing. Kickboxing classes are for women. Like, let's yeah. be honest yeah, here. That's hit. who they're for. And did you see him kick the bottle off that dummy's yeah. head? He b- barely. You shouldn't shouldn't count if you can't stay up. Kick I bo- used to do that boxing gym. Remember that was right under the bridge? Leeson's? No. That one's real. There was one that was under the bridge a block up, and it was like, I showed up, and it was just all moms. You're like, this is not, yeah. this really makes you feel. Like Orange Theory. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Can't really say you're going to a boxing gym when that happens. Yeah. But people love it, and apparently it's a really good workout. It's a great workout. But now it's Luke's like if you're dudes, slim. you gotta like grapple. Yeah, he looks great. Yeah, something's working. It's made him more confident. Yeah, clearly. I want to go to a boxing gym where there's like a hundred pound Mexican guy to kick my ass. Yes, that's the dream. Oh my god, yeah. Mexican lightweights are phenomenal. They're the best. Yeah. Boxing lifers must be just like so pissed at the amount of people who are just recreationally Co-opted, using yeah. it as like. Their oh, way. I box. Yeah, like, oh, yeah. You no, you have bar? a timer and you hit a bag for, like, 60 seconds and you use some burpees. Like this. <laughs> yeah. That's what you boys are hating. Yeah, oh, yeah, we are. I'm hating. On, like, on like a 45-year-old dude who, like, takes yeah. up boxing to get in shape, thinking that they're, like, fucking Mike Tyson. It's also yes, self-hate. I, I hate myself. Me too. Yeah, I've been doing a lot of shit that I hate, even in the moment. Like what? It's like everything. Biking? Everything lately. Just hate it. <laughs> just despise it. Yeah. I thought you were saying that how, 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 you, how you started enjoying things. I'm just happy and I don't, but that's it. Yeah. You hate doing them. Mm. I've always enjoyed biking. I didn't need to give up drinking to enjoy biking. That shit is a fucking <laughs> blast. It feels so good. Well, I, I don't, I'm comfortable doing it on the road now. I have the confidence to swerve through cars, which is a big step. Yeah, it is. That's all you have to do. If you play by the rules, you're stopping every. T- 15 seconds. No, you fucking got to mm. be booking through. Biking's a little scary in the city. That's probably a little adrenaline rush for you, though. A little spike. Yeah, it's true. Spike for the brain. Keep you alert a little bit. There's, like, a documentary about bikers in New York. Who, who, and, like, it's dudes on, like, pre- pretty much a derby race. Like, these bikes literally do not have brakes, and they're, like, trying to get from one place in New York to the other. Like, they're flying through intersections, not stopping as they, they go st- through <laughs> full Have you seen those traffic. ghost bikes on the street? I just shit myself. Yeah? Yeah. Go do it. No, I, I farted, and it smells so bad. Oh, no. Oh. So. <laughs> God. That's... <laughs> it's shit, man. That's just shit. Did you shit your pants ass? It's enough. Sh- it's enough. It's enough shit came out of your ass <laughs> to smell like shit. Maybe it was in particle form. I haven't smelt it yet. I don't know if it's gonna hit you guys, but it smells damn bad. <laughs> I- I'm kind of jealous. <laughs> Has it hit? Be. No. I don't think you guys are gonna get it. I just got enough of a taste of it that it was a little taste. 
Spread your ass. You're not getting it at no, all. I can't get it. No. Damn. That's just right. stuck to me. In and out. The sign of a good, good fart. What cologne you're rocking? I don't wear cologne. No, it's shit cologne. Who was like the loser of social media this weekend? Well, Jordan Love was, but now Packers fans are all up in my ass. I don't know if you saw it. He uh, had a video where he was, he was like, I just want to wish happy Father's Day to all Bears fans. And then, like, because the internet is set up in a way that it's like Packers just shit on the Bears because of Rodgers, like Bleacher Report and, like, Sports Center and ESPN all were like, damn, Jordan Love doesn't hold back. And I read it, and I was like, he's saying that I'm his dad. He said, happy Father's Day to oh, yeah. all Bears fans out there. Yeah, he fucked that up. I was like, this is ridiculous. And then now, so Packers fans took that L, and now there's more context that essentially it was a Bears fan asked him to wish happy Father's Day to Bears fans. And so, like, you got to say the context. Like, wait, but that still is stupid. If you're the Packers quarterback, you shouldn't say that. Shouldn't re- You shouldn't grant that request. Aaron Rodgers would never. Never would do that. Yeah, it's ugly. He gave him an 83 on Madden, Jordan Love. That seems high. Crazy. Based on nothing. Yeah. Nothing. Does that not seem high to you, Che? Nothing. Oh, he had a good game. Pretty much all Eagles. starters are low 80s if they're unproven. Like, unless it's a rookie, it'll be like high 70s, low 70s if out of the first round. Che, right now, gun to your head, which one of these rookies has the best year of all the quarterbacks? Boy. I sure hope it's not Bryce Young. Uh, Will Levis not getting good reports so far out of Tennessee. Malik Willis apparently passed him on the depth chart. Uh... I don't head. know. I mean, uh, are we talking stats wise or, or winning? Who's the best season? Just answer the question. Win- your head. Man, winning and like team Who has the best season? I'll you take, you have a fucking hole in your skull. You're, you're, you're head dead. on the ground. CJ Stroud. CJ Stroud, but I do like Anthony Richardson. It's got to be Richardson. Oh, that's a pussy answer. It's going to be Richardson. See how I said it with conviction? Yeah. I love Richardson. Richardson. Stetson Bennett. <laughs> Boom. Did it. Answered your question. Sean McVay uh, and his wife pregnant. Of course, that's the news. Like you wouldn't get you get the Bud Light news two months later, and but you're the first. Did you already know that? No, I didn't know that. I, w- I don't give a fuck that Sean oh. McVay is like that. <laughs> yeah, okay. I mean, it, it apparently five months. So I'm interested if he's going to miss games or this also. Can't. No, I'll, I'll answer you right now. No. Yeah, I don't think so either. Games plural is one game a week. <laughs> yeah, right. Even yeah. if, even if she was like giving birth on a Sunday. The most he could miss is one game. That's true. KB, my loser of the weekend is anybody online who's like, debate me. Yeah, that's let's me and you. One. Let's me and you debate. That more. No, let's debate me and you debate. Me more. I'll put up. I'm gonna put up money, and me and you are gonna debate. It's like, what the fuck are you talking about? It really is so funny that like we're gonna televise it. Like, no, you're not. Yeah, this this is first off never going Schedule to happen. A debate. Yeah, but people think that they can win just because they're like, I said that I would debate him for a billion yeah, dollars. They don't. He wouldn't. And he didn't do it. He wouldn't take my money to argue. And then you see one of those dudes showed up to the doctor's house. Everyone's like, "Whoa, let's relax, buddy." A little far. Yeah. Even see this. Yeah, he showed up to his house. It was like, "Why won't you debate Joe Rogan?" The guy was just like, like on Father's Day, just like, like doing his like weeds in front of his house. He's like, "Hello." He had like a Texans jersey shirt on. It was just like, why won't you debate? And every, it was funny because it was one of those moments where like he thought he was doing something, and everyone was like, "Dude, that's a little far." Yeah, that's uh, wait. What <laughs> what spawned this? Uh, the vaccine. Rogan and RFK Jr. RFK Jr. was on Rogan, and then uh, the like leading whatever virus doctors uh, were being called to debate against RFK Jr. Who is. Uh, against vaccines yes and everyone's just like i just have never seen a debate where i'm like oh maybe presidential debates but like layman debates that have been like that move the needle for me at all no one's gonna change their opinion or just yeah yeah anything over it's just not gonna be interesting civil or like stimulating what happened to rfk jr's voice he's got some issue he just needs the clearest (laughs) yeah but no it's like i think he had like some like actual like bad thing happened to his throat and it's it's tough because i don't think you can win prez prez with that yeah it's kind of like trump calling ron DeSantis a pedophile like it's over 
No oh way, because Ron DeSantis this weekend said he would have been one of Jesus' disciples. Really? One of, one of the 12. <laughs> I wonder if Trump it. just is so good at what he does. He just gives someone a nickname, it's over. I wonder what he what nickname Pocahontas. he would give RFK. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that one. Ron, Ron D. Sanctimonious. <laughs> good. <That's> good. <laughs> Meatball. And he, I guess he's been calling him Rob, which is just an all-time <laughs> grade school <laughs> fucking <laughs> hilarious thing. Just call him the wrong name. And you know it's on purpose. Oh, yeah. You can't come back from that. Pocahontas was such a good one. Yeah. Pocahontas was great. And what was it? Fuck. What did he say? He had another great one. Oh, Low T Jeb was. Uh, that was it. <laughs> that was a good he one. Di- he couldn't come back from that. It was that. done. <laughs> it was done. <laughs> he's, a, he's maybe the greatest nickname giver of yeah. all time. What I wonder. What's his nickname? What do you get Ted Cruz. Oh, dog wife. Life <laughs> <laughs> is a dog. Yeah. I think he was also calling him. Isn't Ted? What's Ted's real name? Raphael. Yeah, I think he was just calling him Raphael. Oh, really? Yeah, no, with that. <laughs> I didn't know that. It's funny. It's just like he can't be stopped with the nicknames. It is his his greatest political power. That's why I'm excited that Chris Christie's back in the mix because, yeah. like, no jokes hit like fat jokes. Yes. So if he's just Done. like, yeah. at titties, <laughs> roast Chris Christie. At the buffet. <laughs> you know, I hope he comes with a fresh batch of uh, nicknames this time around. Hey, even Sleepy Joe works. Sleepy Joe's good. <laughs> Sleepy Joe, Joe Biden. But didn't work on I know that. we're talking a lot of politics right now, but... I laugh every time Joe Biden has to leave a stage and he does the like this way, that way, yeah. which way did yeah. I come from? <laughs> <It's> like <laughs> and he does it with a little shuffle where he's like yeah, trying to get someone to point to where he should walk. Do you think there's any chance he wins again? <sighs> Dude, he's they can't form he said God save so the queen the other day. Old. He's so old. Do you see that? He said, God save the queen. Really? <laughs> the fucking, the, have we ever watched so the, lost. the video of him coming out in Ireland? With the music? No. You've never seen that? Dude, I, I feel so bad to watch any of them. Oh, you got a TJ, can you pull up the video of him walking out in Ireland? It's like a WWE intro. Oh, I feel so insane. bad. I, I just, it's oh. sympathetic. We feel s- bad. I feel so bad. You for, feel bad for the president. Yeah, you, we should just not elect him. He's so old. You think he gets the least in-office pussy of any president ever? He has to. I don't think Because you know before. all of them have been... But uh, oh, I, was saying, be. I was saying last night that I, I think... Joe Biden is like, I, I bet he constantly has a full shit in between his ass cheeks. <laughs> <laughs> like, you know, also when you have, like, an itch, you know when you have an itchy ass and you wipe and there's like shit? Yeah. That's him 24 hours. He has yeah. like the soft toilet seat that yeah. always has a yeah, big yeah. shit. Yeah, with the bar next to it. There's always a shit stain on it. <laughs> yeah. There's no way he ever has it's a like clean foam. <laughs> He also right. definitely like falls asleep in meetings and shit oh, yeah. all the time. Yeah, it's so crazy that in the White House that like back to back presidents just have to use the same toilet. Yeah, yeah, just going back like Trump. Kind of a cuck move. Yeah, like you have to redesign the whole bathroom or at least oh, put a new toilet. <laughs> no. Game of Trump kick It's like a Conor McGregor walkout. <laughs> oh, it's like where am I? So confused. <laughs> oh man what a crazy old fuck <laughs> Why are people going crazy for him oh <laughs> dude he is so fucking old he's so old dude. he's uh, he's like that but like dude there's a is he older than trump I think, I think like so. The He's like 80s. Trump is old as fuck. Yeah, Trump's old. Yeah. <laughs> Trump is embarrassingly yeah. old. Yeah. But he's old like uh, where like he's obviously done bad stuff in the past that his mind's making him forget. Yeah. He's like the yeah, old of like suppressed yeah. memories. He's so old. Oh, yeah. He's so old. He's at that age where like it, everyone has had grandparents age like you could have a full conversation about him, like in the kitchen, right next to him. He would yeah, one of those old. Oh, yeah. Just chopping carrots. Just like, yeah, right. we should probably take away his car keys. Oh. 80. 77 isn't that? Eighty. Eighties. But he's like, he's he's what he should be for his age. He's no, a, he's, he's an old eighty. You think he's worse? Yeah, he's, Dude, he's like oh, one he's of those old olds where his like, grandparents are in their eighties and they're. Like him. You know that old that you hit where your mouth is never closed and you're yeah. always just <laughs> making that <laughs> exhale noise? Yeah. 
Like a, bu- a fly flies into your mouth. It's decapitated by the spit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hanging off. His molar probably, his molars touch like twice a day maybe. Yeah. I think you're 100% right. I think he's been suppressing memories for so long that his brain just suppresses tell good memories too. Now he just doesn't yeah. know anything. Do you, think, do you think Jill has to cut all his food for him? Dude, not Jill, I don't think he somebody. can do anything himself. <laughs> I don't think he can eat normally. That should be the I, test. No, I like that he always has a full turd in his full cheeks. The only thing that gets it out is another turd pushing. Yeah. I don't that, think he can wipe his ass. That should no be the way that he's wiping his ass. That should be the test right before you can take the office. You have to eat uh, like 36 Steak. ounce like T-bone on live television yeah. in front of America. That will be the final test. Yeah. <laughs> Instead of debates, that really yeah. can work. Yeah. yeah, like let's see you eat a steak, bro. I've never seen him do. Is there anything. footage of him eating? Yeah, I've never seen him eat. I've never seen him like drink a cup of coffee. Yeah, the, yeah I, I think he he licks ice cream. Yeah, like he a, does eat ice cream. He definitely oh, doesn't so eat solids. Definitely though. licks like a Snickers ice cream. Bro. I feel like if you ask me, like, what does Joe Biden eat? Him just ice cream cones. Yeah. <laughs> I've never even seen him with Jill though. I feel like Jill's on Doctor like, Jill. Doctor Jill's on the secret <laughs> secret service bus, like the owner from Major League, just like seducing yeah. Secret Service, just Wait. being a little. Is she like a doctor doctor? I think she's a doctor doctor. That's bullshit if you're a doctor and you're like a therapist. You think it, he remembers? To, to make everyone say, yeah, look. Yeah, there's two ice cream. It's ice cream. Chocolate, yeah. chocolate chip. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't this during oh, like a yeah. massive, like, per- there was like something bad happened. There was like a shot. January 6th commission. Oh, it's a whole, there's a whole. Dude, I'm telling you, he only eats ice cream. Oh. Yeah, wasn't he supposed to be addressing something like really serious? And January he was like, 6th. Yeah. <laughs> chocolate, chocolate, chocolate chip. chip. <laughs> they asked him, what's your response to Republicans about this? He said, eat some chocolate, chocolate yeah. chip. Yeah. <laughs> That's a man whose brain does not work at all. Uh, His brain got, is ice cream. Do you know what like, like a verb is? But it's also like, if you're one of his staffers, do you imagine the, what is she? Education. Okay. You can so call like a her doctor. Professor. Right. Uh, imagine being one of his staffers, though, and just being, like, scared of everything. Like, all right, we're going to go give an address today. Like, okay, oh, so. Dude, they have the most stressful. Are there, oh, yeah, are there, any, are there any bumps on the platform? Yeah. How many steps are there? Crush What's up this distance? pill and put it in his ice cream. Yeah, what are the distances we'll focus. on the step? Are there regular steps? Any big steps? Any landings? <laughs> you have to map it all out. He's all ranks. He's a guy who... I, I, he's like one of the presidents who you th- he's. It seems like he's not doing drugs. He definitely should be doing. Oh, drugs. there's some times where he'll give a speech and it's like he'll have come out of his haze and he'll be like speaking cogently and you're like, oh, he's on the fucking cocktail. Yeah. I don't know why all the presidents don't get just Adderall prescriptions. I think they, uh, they have to. I think they all do. More than okay, that. good. They probably doing something, something right. Yeah. The Surgeon General is that what the Surgeon General does? Administers. Just gives him a. F- like Bill Romanowski tray of all their pills that they have to take during a week. I know Biden's hiding some under his tongue, though, spitting it out. <laughs> yeah, Crafty yeah, bastard. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> Trying to stop me from saying horse monkey dog face. <laughs> ride a bike today. <laughs> Listen, fat. I forgot my cupcake. How am I going to take my pills without my cupcake? <laughs> Frank. <laughs> Oh yeah, he said that he couldn't take his. Frank pills can't take his, um, pills without his zebra cakes or dessert whatever. cake. Yeah, or, yeah. Oh no, he Frank met Peyton Manning. Yeah, that must have been a good convo. Eating in the mines. Frank heaved Jenks under the bus. Oh my uh, that was god! In reverse. Oh, that was. He pulled that up. Actually, speaking of which, Morgan and Morgan. Mm-hmm. Jenks should go to Morgan and Morgan for what he what Frank did. Personal Boom. injury there, yeah. Yeah, if you've been injured in an accident, Morgan & Morgan makes it easier for you. File a claim online, upload pictures, evidence, text your lawyer, get a settlement direct deposited, do almost everything from your phone. Morgan & Morgan is America's largest injury law firm, over 800 lawyers nationwide, over $15 billion recovered so far, over 100 offices, over 30 years of experience. The fee is free. You only pay if you win. The price for pain is infinite, and that's why Morgan & Morgan will fight for full and fair compensation for their clients. Up to date, they have recovered over $15 billion for them. They try, to, uh, they try more cases than any other law injury law firm in the country. Visit ForThePeople.com slash yak or dial pound law to start a claim today. ForThePeople.com slash yak or pound law to start a claim today.
Yeah, Jenks got bodied by Frank. I hear people are unhappy with the overproduction of the rib video. It was it was Jenks' idea. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be releasing an alternate tank cut soon. Dropped it this morning. Can we, can we see it real quick? Give us a little jump through of it. I just need to make sure that logo still slides right off the uh, the, the right side. Poor Jenks. Poor Jenks. Where's Brandon? Uh, Got to Wednesday. Manja, manja, bon appetit. Already better. Eat. It's time for Tanks Cooks. <laughs> manja, manja, bon appetit. Let's eat. It's time for Tanks Cooks. <laughs> it's time, it's time, it's time once again for Tanks Cooks. All right. <laughs> Why is Tanks Cooks? Tanks Cooks. We're going to use the traditional grill over here. Yeah, and we're going to start, we got half it. of it uh, fired up so we could uh, cook over indirect heat. I, I, that's one mistake I've, I'm going to try to learn from. Racks of ribs, racks of ribs, hopefully they come out good and not char up like they did last year. Racks There's of still ribs, a little bit racks extra. of ribs. Zoom in. There's a little bit dynamic aspect. Yeah, it's, it's, I think we need Doug's back I, I, on the. It just needs to be a static a camera. Now. Yeah. I see a membrane. All right. Yeah, well, little, they're doing too much with the zooms. We're going to lightly coat this uh, with this nice uh, oil. <laughs> so be light. Oil, oil, the ribs. Look at the oh, mouth yeah. of that. <laughs> oh my God. It's a guzzler. And we're going to put it in this nice little. Wee, look at this, it's spinning. Is that an aftermarket jug? How did he get a mouth that big? All right, looks yeah, like pepper. So hey, now we got it. This is a little out of focus. We got to add lots of salt. Hey, la 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 la. I think it's snow. <laughs> Does it feel Let's like it's snowing? Started. All right, let's get some pepper. This uh, Texas Roundup Barbecue Rub. Yes. Ooh, got intense smoke. Whoa. 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 <laughs> That's more than rub. <laughs> That's molestation. Oh, come on. Put in this rub. Oh, more. This rub is on here. It's gonna cook well. Smack that, smack that in, lots Frank. And lots of spices. That makes it nice. All right. And, uh, in, uh, James we down. might need to, we need to cut them this them part. I need to get this thing uh, open. Pa is this like an announcement? Paprika. Yeah, this is, do you have a mail? Paprika. <laughs> yeah. Paprika. 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 Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. I'm gonna be adding this at the end, so we'll cover it with some aluminum furl. So he does a dry, a dry wet rub. Yep, dry wet, wet rub. All very right, rarely we got our ribs all rubbed up. It says cover in the canola oil. I cannot believe oil it that big. Tightly. <laughs> and this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna put it on. It says 90 minutes to two hours. We'll check in on these in 90 minutes and see if it actually is cooked. Hopefully, they don't char up. Look at the transition lenses on my boy. Redemption, redemption, <laughs> redemption while I swim along. That was great. <laughs> okay, nice. See how everything looks in five minutes. Alexa, set a timer for five minutes. A little smoky. Flamey, flamey, flamey. Another five minutes. Turn it off for another five minutes. We'll see how it looks in another five minutes. <laughs> All, right. All right, let's see what we got. What's he looking for? Oh, right? yeah, they look good. They they actually, do look really look good. damn good. Yeah. Time to play the meal. Time to play the meal. Time to play. <laughs> The meal. Gotta get your crush. Zero sugar. Time to play the meal. And so. Redemption! Yes. 
All right, that was a good, there that we was go. a good cut. There we go. Great cut. Holy, see? And it was so easy to watch. Now, great. Manja, manja, bon appetit, let's eat. I'll see you next time on Tank's Cooks. Tank and uh, Glenny did like do, they would do a similar thing when they review review food. They'd say uh, observation and then they say it three times afterwards. They'd be like, "Ooh, these are hot, 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 hot." <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, he does. Cheesy, 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 cheesy. <laughs> they both would, <laughs> they both hit that like say it and then like. Say well, they it try to think times. of synonyms and uh, <laughs> it's the top gonna... three they can think. Yeah. Of. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Exact word. You could definitely make a sick compilation of them just saying something. Something, something, something. Cheesy, cheesy, cheesy. <sighs> spicy. Spicy, spicy, spicy. <laughs> Gigi, you want to spin the wheel? We're going to be... This is a problem. We got to get rid of this wet. Yeah, we need to reset. Also, uh, we need to figure out our heats. We got to figure out the heats. That oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. My son laughed at me when I came home and I told him I peed my pants at work today. Hey. Oh, good. <laughs> What do you think he thought? Like, what you do with them jeans? Threw them out. Uh, Come on, there it is. Got it. Needed yes, it. Yep. finally. Got it. All right, spin it again. Love it. It's gonna land on wet, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, if it was funny. I just had to tell Dana Beers that I can't do the Bustin' with the Boys Beer Olympics with him next Tuesday. I had to tell him, too. Broke my little heart. Damn. What are they doing? I wonder who he's going to go with. Glenny. Oh. How far down the list were we? How was Glenny not at the top of the list? Well, he doesn't try to pee. It, and he's not allowed in Nashville anymore. <laughs> oh, because of him wanting to move? Yeah. <laughs> You got banned from a whole city. I say Carbone on the first one. Oh, Roan! Called it! No, I didn't. I oh, missed yeah. it. Yeah. Oh, shit. Damn. That would have rolled. That would have rolled. That would have rolled a <laughs> All right, so, yeah, put all the names on there. So we just spin for Is three, it? three man pods. Yeah. I think you should spin and you're the first person in the first pod. I like spin, that. you're the first person in the yeah. second pod. Spin, you're the first person in the third pod. I like, and should we let those three people draft? Ooh. I like that. Three mm-hmm. captains. Ooh. Three captains, and they pick their pod. Snake, snake style. Snakey. Do we have some sort of device to get Clemmer out of like a sewer grate if he slips down? <laughs> yeah, we need to un un uh, wire a hanger or something like that. Yeah. So we, <laughs> we should just have like a, we should have a, a, a a rope around his waist <laughs> <laughs> with some carabiners, <laughs> just in case. Just in case. <laughs> Any sewers, a uh, deep crevasse like on Everest for him. Yeah. That'll be deadly. He just gets sucked up into a storm drain. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> right. Oh, Anthony is the homeowner. Anthony is the homeowner. I guess we'll wait. Let's see if we. It's the. Any of the three of us that we could draft. Otherwise, we'll just keep spinning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. KB. No. Yeah. Oh. All right, so is KB pick now? No, me. Oh, shit, yeah. No, we're going to spin again for another captain. Yeah, let's get all three captains first. We should just keep off the Anthony. Let's just keep those guys off. It should just be the six of us. The six of us can be captains. That makes sense. Yes, they're not. Yeah. Not here. And then we'll just pick. I need a picture of Anthony, though, before we we pick. Yeah. We all need to see. Oh, him. yeah. Can you like, text that's us only a picture? Fair. I need weight and height. I need bench press. I need to see him doing a three cone. Okay, Roan, also a captain. Okay. The pod system. Yes. We're doing snake draft or regular draft? Snake. I think, well, the snake will probably make it a little fairer, right? Yeah. Sass. Sasquatch. Okay. All right. And what? We you pick who gets first pick. You'll get first pick because yeah, it landed on first. you first. Yeah. That's fair. Okay. So you want bad people, right? Correct. Yeah. 
I don't want first pick. I'll take third pick. All right, I'll take first pick. Hey, uh, do I want third pick? Yeah, if you have third pick, you can fill out your pod immediately, right? Oh, you got to. Oh, yeah, you can. What do you mean? Yeah, I'll take third pick. If it snakes back and it's pods of three. Okay. Okay. Send you guys a pick, huh? Oh, boy. All right, first pick. I have first pick. Oh, we can fuck this guy up. Yeah. Fine. Yeah. <laughs> That's, I am worried. Oh, we're going to a dork's house. Yeah. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> I was thinking he was going to be like a 250-pound New Jersey Italian. We're good. He does have a penis, though. He does have a penis. According to his Twitter bio. Oh, yeah. What? Two eyes, two ears, chin, mouth, ten fingers, two nipples, butt, two kneecaps, and a penis. All right, I'll take second pick. Okay, Sass, go ahead, first pick. Uh, Clemmer. <laughs> okay. Roan. Fuck. Let me. Th- I need another picker, uh, picture of this homeowner. <laughs> Do it. Take him. He tweeted photos of himself. Take him. Two nipples. Nick follows him already. Just did, man. All right, Nick, be on my be on my team, Nick. All right, all right. I'll take Jerry and fuck it. I want to take down Che. I'll take down Che. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. All right, I'll take. Or be the best. You gotta beat the best. He's not even the best. Che sucks. Challenge accepted. He said he's an eight to ten. Yeah, but it- if only there was a number to give that. <laughs> I'm taking. I'm not scared of Che. I'm calling him out. I love, I love that. Calling him out. All right, I'll take the homeowner as well then. All right, so Sass, you got KB. All KB, right. that's. I was last. Oh, that's good. I really know, good. but it means that's because I said I was a nine. <laughs> I'm not good. Yeah, at, you, I, I, it was that official no accuracy. I can't throw a football. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Wait, so is it. Uh, yeah, I can't throw. So we only have two people? Yeah. No, so man, it's you. It's just me versus KB? You, Clemmer, and KB? You took Clemmer. Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, I was on the team. Nice, nice. Big Cat, Jerry Che, Roan, Nick, homeowner, Sass, Clemmer, I KB. think we're the group of death. And you did that to I yourself. Might, I might have made myself in the group of death. And you did Fuck. that to yourself. Because I want to be. But we did wild card, right? There's one wild card. Yes. Yeah. One from each group plus one overall. Yep. That's actually good, Jay, because we'll be better than everyone because we'll, we'll push each other. Yeah. Iron sharpens iron. Me, Clemmer, and KB, that's a solid group. Me, Nick, and the what homeowner, none winning? of us might win. <laughs> we, we might put up zeros across the board. Yeah, I don't know what's going to happen. The sneaky best part of this day I will is... do. I'll do a, th- uh, a thousand points to the winner. Hmm? If everyone, if, but if I win, then everyone has to give me a thousand points. combined fair. a thousand points. Is that fair? Deal. Fair. Okay. The sneaky best part about this day is all the catch that's going to be played like off camera. That's going to be sick. Yeah, well, the what? Playing, we're gonna all the catch. <laughs> sure. That was the best part of the invitational, I'll just like going, going to shoot hoops all the like catch. on the court. We're going to bring a football or what? Let's bring it. Yo, we got to get a free. We should freeze Shay out. No yeah, one should play no, catch. He shouldn't be allowed. No, that would be, that'd be, be fucked up. No one played catch with Shay. No, that would be real Boss's fucked up. orders. <laughs> the sneaky best part of this day is just going to be the laughs that we're going to have off yeah. camera. Yeah. Just playing catch with time. Having a hot dog with the guys. You literally are a dog. I just can't wait to go to the field. Best part's going to be playing fetch with the guys. <laughs> One of my favorite parts of 2022 <laughs> is the Barcelona Invitational, just shooting around on the court. Yeah. It's nice. I hope Big Cat plays fetch with me tomorrow. <laughs> he's got his little dream board. People love dogs. Big Reed. Big Reed. He's having a beer already. Yeah. By the way, NASCAR upcoming race, Alley 400, Nashville Super Speedway, June 25th. At 7 p.m. Eastern on NBC, Parker McCollum, pre-race concert, guitars and fast cars, under the lights of Music City, Will and Taylor from Busted with the Boys will be honorary race officials for the race, and the new Barstool Bar in Nashville will open to race fans all weekend, so come hang with Barstool Talent, 7 to 9 p.m. I'm going to be there. 
Friday, Roans will be there. Chase will be there. Saturday, 6 to 9 p.m. Friday, uh, 7 to 9 p.m. 2023 is the 75th anniversary of NASCAR. And I'm going to have the hiccups. Someone finish the read. Uh, Tommy Smokes is also going to be there. You are not going to want to miss this. It's going to be absolutely sublime. Also, the Chicago Street Race, July 2nd, 5.30 p.m. Eastern. Oh, that's going to be, be awesome. that's going to be cool. The street rate, whenever they get to the streets, you know that they're having a good time. It's not all cooped up on a track. They really get to free themselves, free their minds. Content Kim's here. She doesn't have any cookies. Oh, mm. no mocktails. What are you doing in my golf bag? This guy's rummaging. When was the last time you motherfuckers rummaged? <sighs> and I, I'm really rummaged. I just saw them rummaging through, like, the, the, some interns rummaging through the clothing that's getting given away from everybody's desk piles. People are rummaging, but it's I, not you, motherfuckers. I don't, I don't rummage anymore. I don't think I rummage. I don't like rummaging. Ron, are you staying for that race? The Nashville, uh, the one on Sunday? I don't think 7 so. Eastern on NBC? No? I don't think so. I'm not going to be A few at people one. are, I think. Yeah, people are going, and uh, but I just need to get back to get to the... I'm fucking... I'm going to be missing the Big Apple. So I got to get back out here. But I will be back in time to watch it on TV, NBC, 7 Eastern. Or if you're out there, 6 o'clock local time, go to the Barstool Bar. Make a meal of it. Make a mm. weekend of mm. it. I know I'm going to go down there, maybe get me some 800 degrees, some mm-hmm. some spicy Nashville mm-hmm. fried chicken. Stop at Five Daughters, my favorite donut place down there, and mm-hmm. watch some NASCAR. Mm-hmm. Some donut place? Five Daughters, it's called. <sighs> Bill brought Daughters. that for us. It was phenomenal. Yeah, it was great. He brought it for you? Yeah. When I we must have put him onto that. I kind of have to try it now. I must have. Oh, dude, you'll I appreciate it. it so much. They have these thousand-layer donuts that are like... Oh. Each layer most. tastes like a tiny bit different, though. <sighs> yeah. thousand he, layers? I had 126-layer biscuit. Five daughters? The other day. That's a lot of daughters. I know. Look at that shit. Oh, I'm going to go. That's a thousand... That's a thousand oh, I'm going. Ones. Oh, I'll be there. Look at that. Damn, that looks dude, so good. It's fucking awesome. It's, it's like the a elite... Donut that I've had in my life, oh, and I chase it. Yeah, oh, I'll, my ass will be there. You're, you're going to Nashville this week? I'm going tomorrow, tonight. Really? Yeah. You don't say. Yeah. For, for, for the barstool bar opening? No. Just for fun, vacation. Oh, come on, tight end you. And then you, bro. Yeah, I knew. I knew that. You did know that because he said it last week. Said it last week, and I said, damn. I'll be back Wednesday, possibly Wednesday, but obviously I'll be back Wednesday. You never know with Nashville. Well, you never I know don't... if you're going to go for a day or a month. I got my son's graduation Wednesday morning. Huge. Oh, shit. High really? school? <laughs> Time flies. Four. <laughs> He's graduating already? He's graduating from, from that being... That should be more of a normal thing. Those being three awesome. to being four. Yeah, that's fun. Huge. It's like a birthday party. But... I'm going to cry. Oh, aren't you going out to Nashville this week, too? Well, we ju- yeah, just said that. Yeah, what the Friday. fuck? Hello. <laughs> Bro, you are you are down bad. Yeah, I'm struggling. One day of drinking, the brain cells are dying at an alarming rate. <laughs> Come down to Nashville, though, bro. I can't. You got spots? Yeah, I got shit to do. Where at? The stand. <laughs> oh, no. Friday. Oh, no. Friday. I know how that's going to get down at the stand. Let me come see you. Feel free, brother. Where, where are you at? Upstairs? Upstairs and downstairs. In your fucking nightgown? <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. My l- last spot on Friday is at 1.30 a.m. Oh, you'll be hammered. No, I'm going to be dead sober. That boy is hammered. That boy's, uh, that boy's a liar. <laughs> <laughs> you hear the idol got canceled? No way. Oh, and also <laughs> he, he did, popped yeah. his top off, kind of. Oh, really? Like, sh- like shoulders up, kind of cheap. That's got to be one of the least successful HBO shows ever. Ever. I mean, uh, canceled on the no, a lot of them get canceled, like like uh, Bill Simmons' two? show. Are they even going to show the rest <laughs> of yeah, the episodes? Yes. End it now. Most people get canceled, you don't know anything about it. Yeah. Everyone's just mocking him. What if they have a good turnaround? Bill Simmons at least had like a month. Barely, though. This show will get the whole season, I bet. But they also, you could tell, I didn't watch yesterday's episode, but uh, I saw that it was like 46 minutes. Like, they're, like, definitely cutting massive parts oh, out, being like, no. we could not oh, no. get flamed more for this. You're, you're boys with The weekend. How do you, you you meet up with them? What do you say? Dude, he he put out, like, a statement being like, I, this is exactly how I planned it. 
I no, he's, like, yeah. he's like he was like I, I wanted everyone to be wanted uncomfortable to be watching this show. Yeah. It's like, dude, I don't think so much so it got canceled. Yeah, <laughs> well, he's a fucking artist, dude. He's constantly pushing the boundaries. What what did he say? What was the exact thing that he said? He said something like that. I think it was about the clip about him like telling a girl to like spread her pussy lips, and he was like, "This is the disgust that I wanted people to feel. Like my character is supposed to elicit this emotion." Oh yeah, he's like, "I'm like a. It's supposed to be highlighting like the scummy L.A." And I was the only one that could play it. <laughs> oh, dude, if he didn't play it, I bet that show would have done so much better. If it wasn't The weekend. Yeah, just anyone else saying for the girl to spread her pussy lips. Did he actually say that? Yes, dude. Does he say the episode the two? Spread your pussy lips. Yes. <laughs> like a dirty talking scene. We get the that least sound sexual bite? thing ever. Can we get that sound bite? Spread or your... spread that those tight s- pussy lips. Or spread your labia. Yeah. Fine. Yeah, <laughs> Let me get under that labia of yours. And it, I think, is actively ruining his music Sp- for everyone that listens. <laughs> dude, spread your pussy lips is like an Anthony Weiner text. Yeah, <laughs> it's Penny uncomfortable. Like Ray Allen. What are you thinking about right now? I'm thinking like about that. spreading your pussy lips. Fucking. <laughs> who, who's that like hunk actor who the videos came out of him being like, "I want you to squirt for Army uh, Hammer." No, it's no. Yeah, well, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's some shit that he would say. Just walking around like the subway station, just being like. Squirt for me. There is really no. Squirt for me. Do you feel bad whenever someone gets those? Te- like, if you're sexting, if it's ever released, it will look bad, because it's a bunch of people who are not horny as fuck reading it. Right. Uh, you're not in a clear headspace when you're sending that. Right. You're saying shit you yeah. would never. Say. That's borderline worse than a sex tape coming out. Or maybe worse. Right? Sex sexting. Sex oh yeah. I'd be like, yeah. what do you want to yeah. do to me right now? Yeah. There's only one way to fuck. There's a million ways to sex. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm thinking about spreading your pussy. Yeah. What, what would be like the best case situation? Ah. You got your sex release. What were you saying? But even Something funny. Like, you're e- like playing around. Yeah. I think that's the only way. Straight stuff. Oh, you're gonna show me how you squirt. Girl. <laughs> <laughs> that's brutal. Like even if you're like so straight, like I want to fuck so you so hard. If you read that, that's. Worthy. It also oh. is like uh, it just reveals how you think about sex in like the wording that you use, right. which is always inherently super embarrassing. Yeah. Like your contextualization of what you think hot is. I want you to suck me while I suck you. Yeah, a double sucking. Yeah. I want oh, oh suck you know, be so hot. Bad. Me taking you from behind. <laughs> <laughs> uh, if that came out, if texts of you came out like that, oh, that would be, I would probably be like, no, dude, text like oh. that. I wouldn't be able to like look yeah. at you in the oh. face. Oh. Like, so I'm thinking about staying in New York now. I don't know if Chicago. <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you know what I'd love to do is I'd love to put my penis in your vagina. Uh, I would never be able to look at any of you guys in the eyes. Ever. Now. Oh. This is worse than a sex tape. We have Way to be able worse. to find just the w- sentence of the weekend saying that. Because isn't there like a five second rule we're allowed to play like three seconds of something? Spread you your pussy. Still eat it off the ground. I want to suck your nipples. <laughs> <laughs> he said tiny little tiny pussy. Tiny little pussy. Oh. He says it with like an underbite. Yeah. Ah, dude. They had to script in two s- adjectives <laughs> for pussy. Tiny little pussy. <laughs> He's crying. Oh, his teeth. dude, he's got to be mortified. He's got to be trying so hard to find a positive outlook on this. No, he's lying to himself. Yeah, yeah. that's what people like, do in situations like this. Tell themselves that they are not in the wrong, but it's, I don't blame that him. It's everyone that. else. That's how he should be. <laughs> he shouldn't have put himself in this situation in the first place, you though. He like kind of sings like that. A lot of his lyrics are "Let me like watch you." Let me it. suck your pussy from the back. Yeah, he gets away with a you lot. You tripping cum, like yeah. And he puts in a nice melody. That's how right. Bad Baby is. Or what is that his name? Yeah, right. What's that yeah. guy's name? Bad, no, bunny? Not bad Baby. Bad Bunny. Bad Bunny. Bad Bunny. Bad bunny. He's very sexual as well. Is it just in Spanish? Yeah, but at least he's not going on camera and saying that shit. Using the word tiny, oh. yeah. tiny little, tiny little. Yeah. Oh. So it's like young and small. Spread your young and spread. I like your my pussy small. Spread your <laughs> small p- t- pussy for me. Oh, your pussy's too big. Well, you got the itty bittiest <laughs> pussy. Aw. Oh, you your had p- it down there. <laughs> it's cute as a button. <laughs> <laughs> spread Oop. that big wide pussy for me. I can't wait to watch you grow up. <laughs> <laughs> That's why you really have to give so much credit to, like, Drake, who could have been in a role like that. And oh, he's like, yeah. no, this will be corny. He just like, does it real life. 
Yeah, I'm, I'm sure he does. I mean, I'm, I bet the weekend does too. I bet they're both. But yeah, if it came out that the weekend was doing that in real life, that'd be way better. That wouldn't like he no one would care. Yeah, but he he actually should say this is based on my life. Yeah. He's like no, I actually said that. You're right. Like w- the weekend's such a good singer that people will love him. He sings just like that. Yeah, people would be cool with and then, it. And there's also some women that probably see that and they're like, that's probably the had the confidence. Thing ever. Like he, people, he, yeah, people, women reinforce that, and now he's like, oh, I can do a show and do the same thing. Yeah, now one called Kissland, right? Kissland, horrible. Come on, Starboy. Oh, should we play Kissball on Thursday? Could Starboy's a bang. Talking about it. Oh, it's the best music. I'm a motherfucking Starboy. Yeah, but that's funny too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Imagine if he just said that in script form. Yeah. I'm a motherfucking Star. I'm Tell a me, star I'm a Starboy. <laughs> I'm a party monster. Spread your pussy for this star boy. So I noticed in the script it said little pussy. Yeah. Is there anything we can do to zhuzh that yeah. up? <laughs> Fuck, the writers are on strike. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have to come up with something myself. Five daughters is That's crazy. A tiny pussy. Tiny, tiny, tiny. <laughs> <laughs> I need, um, I need, I need, I need yeah. uh, Glennie to review yeah. pussy. Yeah. Tiny, 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 I almost tiny. lost it. It was so small. <laughs> small, 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 small. Tiny, tiny, tiny. Tiny <laughs> <laughs> pussy. Oh God. We really been chopping it up today. Tree. Yes. What? what? What type of vape is that, bro? What the fucking Ninja Turtle is? Yeah, where are you getting that? Ontario. That's the Ontario vape. Yeah. What they got out there? Cali vape. Cali. Should we? Uh, what? Sporkle? I'm down. That's going to be a bad performance for me today. My <laughs> brain is fucking... Don't say that, Sass. You right. know what you know, bro. I'm disgraced. You've hit an hour and 40. I'm terrible about myself. You did great. You've been doing great. You're like a dumbass. We have an interview in 20 minutes, so let's right, do it. Yeah, let's, let's rip a couple sporkles and get out of here. Hint who it is. Yeah, who you guys interview? Just say who it is, Sass. Lemaire. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. Nice. It's Lemaire. We got to... Oh, fuck. Oh, give away. <laughs> Lemaire <laughs> requested. Come on. You don't have to say that. Yeah. You can say <laughs> yeah, the hell? Under the bus. He said he wants to have a fun time. <laughs> you got to bring me out as your translator next time you go to these Hispanic cities. You're, you're like cities. I know. Frank the Tank. You this know? podcast doesn't w- go well. You're like, well, it was the mayor's idea to come oh, we've on. We wanted to have Lamar on, but he hit there me. There you up. go. There you go. And it's, yeah. I wanted to have Brandon on, though. I wanted to have them just go back and forth and name wrestlers for like uh, as yeah. long as they could. Yeah, we should just have them on. Have Nick do it. I could do it. Yeah, but Nick would just wash anybody in that. It's not Special really way, it, you can Fast forward to the end, me winning. Yeah, I'm pumped for Lemare. I wish I was in better spirits. <laughs> Let's get some sparkle Let's wins. Get some spirits. Let's go. I'm ashamed of myself. All right, pull it up, huh? To reset my sober tracker. Right, so people were saying that for Apple? the podcast listeners, yeah. before you answer, just say what you're answering. Ah, uh, color of blood. Okay, so one color of blood, two current hosts of Jeopardy, three best-selling candy bars of all time, four female leads from Ghostbusters <laughs> 2016, uh, no. five Will Smith movies with aliens, six countries that border India, seven NBA players with over 10,000 career assists, eight presidents who died in office, nine current shows on in the Real Housewives franchise, ooh, and ten best-selling video games. I'll tough. let you redo that ooh you did one time. Ooh, uh, better all right go Ooh. ahead Sass. um i'm gonna go 10 best-selling video games i'm gonna go minecraft good answer good answer i think it's actually maybe the best-selling video game ever Number one it up is. there yeah. i'll go one color of blood red and rightfully so i'm actually gonna go home and play minecraft I mean, yeah minecraft rocks. fucking is awesome you wanna be on a server together yes i actually would do that okay TV? yeah um video game grand theft auto yep I'd have to uh, have to switch one though. Let's see. Oh, not thiefed. Oh no! Oh, Kyle, give one. Give one. Five V. Yes. No, oh no! It has to be. Oh, yeah. there you go. Number uh, two. Eight presidents died in office. John F. Kennedy Jr. He was in a convertible. Oh. Junior? Um, <laughs> <laughs> you isn't junior. Uh, let's do five Will Smith movies with aliens, Men in Black. Yep. Good pull, Nikki. Good pull. I'm thinking. Yeah, that's There's it. Four more. Success. I think. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna go. Some are very similar to that. Fortnite. 
It is. Oh, sassy. Out early. Oh, oh, my boy's is out early. early. It's not best selling, right? My boy's it's out free. early. That does not make sense at all. Wow. So um, zero dollars worth of copies. How about um, Independence Day? <laughs> this dude's going right to Google. I am. <laughs> Okay, KB. Um, I am Legend. Ooh. Movies with aliens? I don't think so. No, see ya. What? Uh, zombies. Let's go. Abraham Lincoln died in office. Oh, oh you're gonna smack yourself. Sucks. What do you mean I'm gonna smack myself? Uh, Men in Black Two. Oh. Uh, How about Men in Black Three? Oh. There weren't any in that one. Oh, it's just me and Nick. No, oh, <laughs> got it. Uh, how about Housewives franchises, New Jersey? Uh, I will go Housewives franchise, New York City. I'm back in. No, no yeah, not. yeah. I'm gonna no, you're for not. this. Yes, I am. No, you're not. Not. Yes, I am. No, I'm, back you're I'm just gonna play. Okay, no, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm back no, in not. too. Yes, uh, yeah, we're back in. Both get one Can't just sit here and watch. <laughs> <laughs> That's how it right. fuck. It's literally what me and Sass do every time. Now I'm back. Okay. Who's up? You. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Uh, I'm gonna you go just, no, you're not allowed to do video games. You were looking Fortnite. at it. Fortnite. <laughs> um, <laughs> you demanded to be Why'd back you want in to be back in? you don't have anything. Five. I'm going to go uh, Hershey's Bar. Uh, S H E. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I knocked my socks off. S H H E R S H E Y. That was a creative ass spelling of Hershey's. <laughs> you. <laughs> I just don't, it might not. It be. might not be one of the best selling. Yeah, I don't think it is. What was the co- I don't think that category. Is that how you spell it? Yes. <laughs> You're wrong. Fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> All right. How? How is it not one of the best-selling candy bars? For free. Uh, (laughs) Real Housewives of Atlanta. Fuck you. (laughs) I'm back. (laughs) Oh, shit, he's back. I forfeit. Okay. What? I'm out on my own accord. Get back in. Get back in. You guys want me back in? Hackman. Does anyone want me back? What the fuck? No way. Uh, You guys are both out. (laughs) Okay, if Hackman costs uh, 25 cents. Hackman is legendary. FTR. <laughs> I was so confident in that. I think like FDR. 30 people have Pac-Man in their house. This is all time. I thought, uh, every, I thought everyone in the world bought that. <laughs> Four female leads from you know the Ghostbusters. anyone who owns Pac-Man? Uh, Kristen Wiig. <laughs> okay. K-R-I-S-T-E-N. Uh, W-I-I-G or W-H? There you got it. Okay. Uh, Housewife franchise Dubai. Ooh. No. Yes, Sorry, bro. Yes, Sorry. it is. 100% it is. It says current. Is it still current? Yes. Sorry, oh, Rome. Sorry, Rome. Sorry, Rome. 100% is. <laughs> Sorry, Rome. Are you All sure right. they're in Dubai? In Nick. Yes, it's 100. It's a, there's no way that All it's right. not. Yeah. In Nick. Right, bro. Uh, that shit I'll, is wrong. This time. man has to be top 10. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it's even close. I will go with John Stockton. Oh, Pac-Man is Nick. Okay. Uh. Oh boy. Um. Sixteen. I will go with the consolation prize. I'll take it. Yeah. Uh. Uh. Melissa McCarthy as a female lead for Shit. Ghostbusters. All right, I'm back in. One's back in. <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, Chris Paul. Um, best-selling video games of all. Th- oh man. I will go with Skyrim. Mm, Nikki, Nikki, Nikki. No. no, for the win. Sorry, Jason Kidd. I don't think I've ever won one. There you go. No video games. Current host of Jeopardy, no, uh, Mayim Bialik, and then Ken Jennings. Best-selling candy bars. What do we think? Snickers, Reese's. Snickers, Reese's, and is, is, is that's a cup, not Wicks, a bar. Butterfinger, Kit Kat. Oh, Kit Kat might be it. 
The third best selling video game is Tetris. Oh, Madden is Madden on there? I don't believe so because no. it comes out annually. Tetris, Overwatch, PUBG, PUBG. Show us the answers. The we'll Witcher. do one more. I am PUBG. the Alex. Oh, this sucks so bad. Snickers, Mario Toblerone. Are you kidding me? Skyrim oh, had was on everything. After Toblerone. That. Red Dead Redemption Two is top ten. Yep. Ultimate Way. Girls Trip Pro. It's crazy. After Earth. I don't know what that is. Okay, one more. I was. I. I, I don't understand how. Real Housewives of Dubai is not on this fucking list. That's crazy. Did it dude. get canceled? All right. Joey Chestnut hot dog record number. Uh, two names of property brothers, three Korean car brands, four teams in AFC West, five most streamed to artists on Spotify 2022, six teams to Kevin and Tumbo played for, seven single horned animals, eight high, highest populated island countries, nine members to go on Quest and Lord of the Rings, ten highest gross in film. I am fucked. Ten highest what? Grossing, Grossing film franchise. Uh, Fast and Furious. Or what, what would it it'd be Fast? The Fast? Uh, Star Wars. Ed Sheeran. For what category? You gotta be fucking <laughs> Streamed artist. Damn. There's no fucking <laughs> way. Yeah. Yeah. Pass out. All right, There's no way. <laughs> the Raiders. Ed Sheeran's not top five. <laughs> it, it's hey. going to Google. Go ahead. Like the Go most ahead. viewed artist on Spotify. Uh, uh, highest grossing, gotta be Avengers. He has 82 million that monthly listeners. It. At the tippy. Uh, let's go with the Chiefs for four teams in AFC West. I will go with the Chargers. Damn it. Why are you taking these? You know all the Lord of the Rings. So does Roan. I don't. I don't. It's throwing me off his trail. Okay, Ron. The Atlanta Hawks for the D- Kemba Matumbo teams. Highest populated island nations, Indonesia. Tippy. Tippy. Broncos. Four teams in the AFC West. Now I'm fucked. Uh, highest populated island countries, I'll go Japan. Japan. <laughs> Kevin hey. Matumbo teams, the Sixers. Nice. <laughs> oh! I was going to say it was 74. Joey Chestnut, 76. Oh, wow. Tricky. Okay. AB? How are you feeling? Stream Dart is 2022. Dua Lipa, Tippy. Nope. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I'll go with the Denver Nuggets for teams that Kevin Matumbo played for. Uh, highest populated island countries. I mean, eight. Is Australia on there? Cool. Lucky guess. Yeah. I'm fucked. Lucky fuck. Highest grossing film franchises, Indiana Jones. Ooh! Those movies in the 80s are tough. Sorry, Ron. James Bond? Hi. Bye. All right, give me a bye. Give me Legolas. God damn it, I'm fucked. I'm so fucked. LAS. So LAS. Legalese. Bye, Nikki. <laughs> bye. <laughs> uh, you guys got to be able to name one top. It, it, it's you just looked these up. Taylor Sash. Swift. Exactly. You missed it. Ed Sheeran, the fact that Ed Sheeran's not number one is crazy. Gimli, G-I-M-L-I. Oh, I'm in a world of hurt here. Fuck. L-I. Um, Hyundai? Oh. No, is that? No, it's E-A-I. H- H- H-Y. I-U-N-D-A-I. Yes. Yeah. Um, Frodo. Nice try, Sass. Did Dikembe play for the Orlando Magic? Or am I thinking of Patrick Ewing at the end? Fuck. Is that a guess? Show me Orlando Magic. Oh! Oh. Win. Sam. Okay, show us. 
was thinking Knicks too. Fuck. Transformers? Yeah, Transformers is fucking awesome. DC, Jurassic Park, Lord of the Rings, Avatar, Transformers, Wizarding World. What the fuck? Harry Potter. Bad Bonnie. Drake, the Bonnie. weekend. That's a, the single horned animals is tough. Oh, there's a nice win for the weekend. Yeah, let's see how 2023 pans out for him, though. That's true. That's true. He's got to right. re- release an apology. <laughs> like a notes app apology for that for that show. All right. See you everyone tomorrow. I'm going to be out. I'll be back Wednesday. I'll be in. All right. Hey, folks, keep on making these sporkles. We love you. Have a great Monday, everybody. See you tomorrow.